Our this is a dictatorship. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of okay. like we and then like the guests. It's like yeah. we. We invited you separate on. Separate but equal. We invited you on. <laughs> First, you parked in the wrong spot, you fucking idiot. Yes. Then, oh my. That was this annoying. This fucking douchebag <laughs> does this? that to me every fucking week. Dude, it's not up to me, dude, bro. For, it is not what? a surprise. I'm showing up at the same fucking place every fucking week, dude. Uh, Get it together. I know there's a hundred people, and there's thousands of people wow. who live in this place. It, I know it's really hard to deal and wheel and communicate with so many civilians. I'm so sorry I hit a nerve. No, but, it's a big deal. But I this guy can't make one... Eight foot by five <laughs> foot space. I can't. I, for his best buddy. Nobody, this guy doesn't talk to anybody. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Back up. Best this buddy. Guy, I thought we were best buddies. No, no, no. Me and you, we're best we're buddies. We're something else. This guy. Oh, oh shit. You guys are something else. Yeah, we're You don't BFF. know about this? S- our B- parents yeah. were wiping our asses next to each with us. Oh, here. you guys went to preschool? Yeah, she crossed the border just at the same time I Yeah, yeah. Did. Oh, yeah. your mom just fucking. <laughs> yeah, it makes sense, right? Ew. Yeah. Yeah, no. That's that gross. Sense. Yeah, it was Yeah, disgusting. we're best friends. I know everything about him. So I heard you've been, like, setting up an assassination against a specific governor that's been of a certain state. <laughs> what? You've been, like, infiltrating their family through, like, uh, your your means of <laughs> work. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. You, you, like yeah. there's some sort of... I can't, I can't speak on this. No comment. But you're saying, like, there is a certain person that but you are... you can po- confirm no! that you... I- no, wait, wait, wait. You can confirm... That you are in the political game. Are you part of the <laughs> politics? Oh, always. Okay, so okay. that's all we can confirm. And then camera. somebody yeah. might die. Somebody <laughs> out there in the world, not not necessarily a politician. Okay. Not necessarily. <laughs> We're just, not saying anything. Just somebody out there. There's a person who might <laughs> die. <laughs> Maybe. There just might be a death somewhere. Okay. You don't have to say anything. It's fine. We get it. You're... Coming at me for someone dying. This man huffs chemicals all day. That is Not true. anymore. But, oh, come on. I was making a batch of chemicals today. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> that's, that's a downgrade. So you're worried about me? Not really. I was more worried about the like, person that you've been, like, you know, plotting against. Oh, no, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. What do you think? I think I wish I had every menu of Taco Bell right here. I do not eat Taco Bell. What? I, I wish oh, I had every that was menu ex- item of... McDonald's right Taco now. Bell makes me want to, like, you know when a cat makes that vomit noise? That's like. He loves cats right here, actually. Oh, dude, this don't even get right me here. started, bro. I have a cat <laughs> tattoo, and what? I want I want to cover my body in cat tattoos. You want to cover your whole body in cat tattoos? Yeah. Because I, I, so I've already, I've already gone over to the, okay, she's nuts. She has a cat tattoo. People will be like, oh, is it a memorial? I'm like, no, she's three. So I might as well just go full plunge, right? Mm-hmm. A memorial. Yeah, people be like, oh, did your cat pass away? Is that why you got that tattoo? And I'm like, she's literally three years old. No. Oh, is but it is of a cat. It is of a cat. Of yeah. a specific of cat. Of a specific cat. Yeah, my cat. I know we somebody. Also, we also yes, know, somebody. know somebody. Really? Yeah. It's Do actually, I know them? Oh, you know them very well, You know well, them pretty actually. well. They're somewhat of an inspiration to you, you could say. There's somebody that you- There's somebody's girlfriend. You somebody's girlfriend that he maybe knows pretty well. Somebody's girlfriend. Oh, I know who it is. Yeah, so you guys, you know, you're a kindred spirit. God, she's hot. Sorry. All right. Don't That's what I was going to say, too. Don't tell her that. I wasn't going to say that. <laughs> Don't tell her that. that. I will tell her that. Um, Yeah. Coming from me, though. Like, do you think that maybe having your whole body covered in cat tattoos might be a sign of, like, you know, being... Mentally ill? Totally crazy. I'm already there, though. So do you think so that she agrees it is a sign of craziness? Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's what I'm saying. Like, I want to invite the crazy into my life. Isn't there, like, a famous painting of a bunch of cats, like, sprawled out over each other where they're, like, all overlapping and stuff? Cat Dog is a TV show. <laughs> I love, oh, you know I, what? You might be right. That might be the intro of how Cat do they Dog shit? I'm thinking of. How do they shit? Each other's no, mouth. that's so old, dude. I have thought of, I was four when I came up with that concept. They do be shitting. Well, I need to know. Like, that's like one of the great wonders of the world. Well, have you seen Human Centipede? It's similar to that. I did not. Um, I heard about it. Human Centipede 1 is pretty good. 2 and 3. 3 was so so bad, bad, dude. What happened happened to those actors? Like, did they have a life after that? There's no way. Well, they took the girls from Two Girls, One Cup, and then they put them in Human Centipede. You're lying. Yeah, no. I think it was a lot of sodomy involved in their life after that. Yeah, for sure. (laughs) Certified sodomy. 
That's a gross movie, though. The third one did suck, though. The third one was like, do- like literally, we could make a better movie so right here with this. It was like you an indie wa- movie. So you watched the first one, and you it said- was good. It was good. We have to watch the next couple. The next well, two yeah. was like, eh. The eh. second one, I can't fully remember. Was the end of the first one or the end of the second one, the one where the lady uh, steps on the gas pedal, and it's like there's a baby that she just gave birth to? And she shoots the baby out of her pussy, and then I think that's the crushes one. the baby's I, head with the gas pedal. You know what I love? That's hard as fuck. <laughs> Is that that? I love when people talk about shit. I have no idea what they're talking about. So this lady, she was like, oh, she, good, shit, she shit, she yeah. a baby out of her vagina, and then stepped on its head with the gas pedal. Yeah. So she was trying. Okay. Okay. Hang on. I we got to do that. So we. Okay. So we. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So we have. Which to brings stuff. us to our first question. <laughs> no. Wait, wait, hang on. Okay. So wait, we've got. Uh, Imagine there's a, a evil scientist, right? Okay. And he takes all these people. You gotta get the concept of human safety, right? Yeah. Make sure that he puts all these people together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mouth. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, so in the second one, these people eventually get to escape. Something. But the, the main concept of this story is that they get to escape, and this lady, she gets out, and as she's leaving, she's pregnant because somebody, and either she got pregnant there, and she'd been there for nine months, or she got pregnant okay. before that. Either way, either way, she shits the baby out, right? Yeah. And then the baby is in the car because she's about to drive away through a wall. And then she shits the baby out, and the dude's like about to catch her with a knife or whatever. And so she, the baby's in the driver's seat, like, like a water bottle or something, you know? And so Wait, she, so she gave birth in the car? Yeah, she gave birth in the car, like, as this dude's about to attack her. Like, he's, like she's about to get away, and he's like, oh, I'm gonna kill you. And then, like, obviously the stress made her give birth. She okay, shits the baby out. She could have thrown that baby as a distraction at the crazy guy she and gotten away. In a friend. She was uh, nice. a friend. And then she just she stomps on the gas pedal. Little does she know little baby. Brain explodes all over the mm, car. Delicious. And then That's she gets out. Second one. Yummy. Second one, right? Has to be. Third delicious. one sucked though, not even worth explaining. Baby brains. Third one didn't even seem like a movie. It seemed like three separate short films. Yeah, it was stupid. It was like a cool. prison. It was kind of like the movie Rango. Rango? With the, the lizard. lizard? The chameleon? Oh. It was kind of like that, but if Rango was like a rapist, mad scientist in oh. charge of a prison. So a completely different thing. Yeah, that's cool. No, it's, I mean. It does, isn't it kind of like Rango movies. They both drank water. In they the both water. did drink oh. water. <laughs> no, that makes sense. No, so, that, makes, that checks out. That checks out. What are you bringing that. to the table here? I mean, we kind of just invited you. Like, I mean, <laughs> You know what? You don't even have to answer that. We'll tell you. I don't table. bring anything no, to the do. table. No, you do. You bring more than you know. Yeah, like we, we've had guests on before. You know what? This I brought, is already going pretty well. This you know what awesome. I bring to the table? <laughs> do tell. I love that you guys fist bump each other instead of the guest that is. You're over there, though. Uh, no. Don't. <laughs> um. You know what I bring to the table? No. Feminine energy. You guys need it. It's too much male energy. We, I mean, we have a minion up there. You don't. They're kind of genderless. Yeah. Oh, this minion is a they them. If so. oh. That minion had some big old titties. Mm-hmm. Well, it could. It, it could be wearing a corset. Mm-hmm. What are you doing back here, buddy? We were going to have you swear on the Anthony Fauci book like our, one of our prior guests, but we figured you wouldn't be for it, so it's fine. I would. Well, we can maybe do that at the end and then super cut it to the beginning then since you said you would. And then cut, cut the right after this yeah, point. Yeah, to this. Boom. We're back. And we're you know back. that candle thingy? That's Alex Jones. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm ordering some with Pedro Pascal's face on it. Yeah. So what is that? Because it's not just you. I've been seeing that a it's lot. It's the of last I... of us. You fucking idiot, dude. No, no, you no, only no. pay attention to euphoria, dude. Oh you my don't god. Pay no, attention no, no, to no. The way any other that media, my dude. daddy issues just like bubbled to the surface the second I saw that man on television. I just, it was like a volcano erupted, and now I can't stop. I've ordered a Pedro Pascal T-shirt. That's weird. Mm. I have many. Uh, pictures of him saved to my phone that I just browse through. How many eight by twelves did you print out? Oh, I'm I'm gonna. I was gonna get a big like tapestry that says "In Daddy We Trust," but I was told not to. But I think I still will. You were told not what to. What kind of yeah. bad friend? By what? Would like you your dis- other personality? <laughs> <laughs> true. Very true. One of many. <laughs> so that's what I bring to the table as well. How many? Crazy. <laughs> how many? How, how many? How many personalities? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because in Split, there's like at least nine or eleven. Yeah, but you know what? That movie pissed me off. Oh, because you know. It wasn't relatable? No, the ending, he just like becomes a monster. I was like, um, oh. that was sick. Actually. No, but that was stupid. I was like, wow, great movie about mental health. This is great. And then I'm like, oh, sorry, what? 
Well, well he, he he just removed all the pussy mental shit out of his mind. He goes, "I'm a beast." The demons won. Okay. I'm in my go mode. That my demons are mode. winning. That's but you should turn into a giant monster and start beating the shit out of everybody. Then, <laughs> although in your head that transformation is already. I mean, happened. talk to every ex I've had. I mean, <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> it's basically. We'll I love domestic to dude. dude how we'll many def- domestic abusers will we have on this show? <laughs> no, dude. that's not true. I lied about. I'm gonna it. keep pushing, though. dude. We'll yeah. definitely get back to giant monsters eating people and stuff. But I do want to go towards the. She's part- like, this is on camera. I can't admit to domestic violence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> okay, but so but the thing I wanted to make about Pedro Pascal is that you're not the only person that. I've seen that's like obsessed with him as of in the, like the last two months. I think well, not only is The Last of Us big right now, so that's like where he, he looks like such a daddy on that show, but also it's the daddy issues. You have to understand all I, of the girls from our generation oh. had shit dads, and we have a lot of daddy issues. And then we see this beautiful man being a daddy, and we're like, we need him. I thought that that show was about a bunch of dykes. No, it's a bunch a bunch of gaybos. <laughs> They're what? making out. What are you talking about? There's the Last like, of Us. There's like an episode four that all the conservative guys at work stop watching it because there oh was a big gay bow scene. Yeah, there's like two gay men and it's a beautiful scene and I loved it. Well, he's this a union ha- guy. Yeah, the guys in the union didn't like it. This is Them what they men were started kissing? What the Fuck. hell? I'm paying $17 a month to HBO Max. <laughs> Have some freaking gay boat. Uh, no more Nike. No more HBO. <laughs> I forgot about the No Nike. more nothing. No more Carhartt. We can't enjoy anything. Is Carhartt? Wait, what's up with Carhartt? Uh, Mike told me that they were, I don't remember what he said, but he said Carhartt had a big rebellion because they were also gay or something. I don't remember what they were. Oh, for sure. They probably, I don't remember. They just need to admit. Like, they just need to watch it and be like, I admit, like, I'm gay. They just need to be sissy hypnotized. True. I could probably sissy hypnotize someone. Well, oh, you definitely actually, can you could. like so. There's just, hasn't that happened? Have you ever sissy hypnotized anybody? Ha- isn't there somebody? Oh, that- yes, I have. Yes, I have. What? Can you- well, I didn't really hypnotize. Like, he was already a sissy, so I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you want to hear the story? Definitely. That's definitely. why you're here. Okay, so I met this guy on Tinder, and I was like, okay, he's like, uh, my Tinder stories are like bad. Perfect. We'll get oh, there. Yeah. Wait, do you pay for Tinder? Uh, I don't have Tinder anymore, and I never paid for it, so. Okay, continue. Okay, continue. So I met this guy on Tinder, and then he would only talk to me through Discord. Very, makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Discord kitten. Yeah. <laughs> he, was, he was the Discord kitten. And his purple picture was Kanye West. Purple so picture. It, it. I wouldn't say he's purple. What? <laughs> <laughs> Kanye's pretty dark, though. He's pretty close to purple. What are you saying? Okay. <laughs> I have such bad ADHD and you're not helping. Okay. Um, so then we decided to meet up and he was like, yeah, come to my place and we'll um, smoke weed and stuff. And I was like, okay. So I drove there. It was like 45 minutes away. And he's like, yeah, you can't come inside. We're going to smoke in your car. I was like. In your car? In my car. <laughs> I was like, sick. Okay. So we get in his, my car. He comes into my car and then he's like, okay, drive down the block and park over there. I'm like, okay, cool. And so he's going to rob you. Yeah, I was like, all right, sure. And then he not only told me, can you please change your contact info for me? I want my name to be Sissy on there. And I was like, <laughs> wait, no, wait, how did you? That's like the first thing. No, you said. Yeah, it was like, ha, I'm like anxious because I'm like, oh my God, I'm meeting this guy for the first time. And I'm like, hi, hi you want to smoke a joint or something? And he's like, okay, going forward, call me Sissy. I no want my way. name. I want my name in your phone as sissy. And I'm like, and I'm like, like I'm right edgy. Away? So I'm edgy and different. And I'm like so accepting of everyone. So I was like, yeah, sure. You're kidding. No, wait, yeah. no, no, no. You, she definitely. She no, 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 not that part. Oh. I mean, like, it went, hi, hello, let's smoke a joint. Before we smoke well, that joint, call me sissy. Did he take a puff first? I don't think so. Was I think I was. Yeah. Do you think he was no, because before? I think he must have been high before. <laughs> yeah. I think I was rolling. So, and also, uh, my he's weed. probably wearing off. My weed. Anyways. Didn't even bring this weed guy to sounds like a badass. <laughs> this guy Shut sounds like my role model. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Every guy ever. Okay. Um, so then I was just like, yeah, whatever. Then he started telling me how he's a political science major. And I was like, fucking hell, get me out of this car. I <laughs> like, get me out of this mic. Go ahead. Sorry. Like, get me out of this fucking car. But I was like, whatever. We're smoking. Later in the conversation, he continues to tell me all about his political beliefs for maybe an hour straight, and I'm like, wow, cool. 
cool. Yeah, that's You're great. You're like, wow, Maybe women like, shouldn't vote. You're right. I'm like, Trump? Yeah, he's, I love him. Wow. No. Um, Sissies do like Trump. What is with that? Sissies love they Trump. Love because him. T- because T- Trump like really guns. puts them in their place. They want to suck know, like, his orange cock. Well, T-girls and girls like guns. So true. comes down to. T-girls do love guns. Okay. You know, like, that thing that happened? No. What happened? That, that one bad thing that happened where that person was a T-girl. Oh, oh, I think yeah, that yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that picture wasn't actually them. I think that was fake news that I spread <laughs> on the internet. <laughs> oh wait, continue. Sorry, I didn't mean to um, do this. Yeah, but then after the whole political science thing, he then this was way into the high, so now I'm a little He's fully sissified. Yeah, he's fully point. sissified. He asked me <laughs> if I could pull make a necklace with a key to his chastity. Dude, yes, yes. Dude. and he's like, "Will you hold yes. the? Will you hold the key on your necklace?" And again, I'm like, "Did he call it his clit cage, though? Did he no. have a clit cage? Yeah, no. you're kidding. Yeah, and it was locked, and How he wanted. Know? Wait, he pulled it out? No, but he sent me pictures later. Oh, you're I, I thought it was in the well, car. Okay, again, though, I'm sitting here trying to be like, yeah, totally. You're like, so, I love that. I'm like, I am so. I'm actually a dominatrix now, so I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> as of um, 10 minutes ago. Yeah, as of t- right now. So then I was like, yeah, oh my God, that's such a good idea. Anyways, like we do whatever, like stop hanging out. Also like did not make an attempt to hug me, kiss me, nothing. It was sissy. Sissy. He's a si- he wanted you to peg him right there in the car. He then. Did he bring that up? No. Okay. But then, the next, like, three days, he would just send me Reddit posts, like, sissy Reddit posts, like, God. of women, like, stepping on cock and balls, oh, like, I, hate that. I need <laughs> you to do this to me, and I'm like, oh. again, I'm I'm going on Reddit, like, dominatrix, how do you, t- like, how do you train, I have no clue, like, I don't know what I'm doing, so I'm, like, trying to learn how to, like, do this for this man, it like, was a dark time, like, yeah, Ugh. like, through it. But then he ghosted me, so he ghosted you? I was the problem. <laughs> yeah. He's like, she just doesn't get Wait, it. Wait, okay. She didn't punch me in my balls as soon as we <laughs> she met. She did uh, not. Wait, we're not spending enough time, like, really yeah, getting into the in-between parts of these stories. Because they're, like, there's a lot here to unpack for sure. Yeah. Dude, you're just hateful and don't have an accepting it was, heart. It was short-lived. It was short-lived. It was he, a powerful, like, bright candle, though. It was kind you know, of, you know how if you flame. light a candle, it'll he burn did, for a while? I will give you this because you'll like this. Definitely did not have an iPhone and would send me photos that were like oh. the grainiest shit I've ever seen oh. of his literal like asshole. <laughs> like was just he- with no comment, just like, here you go. And I'm like, so what am I supposed to do with that? Is this a person that like exists in, you know, this area? No, it was far away. Far, far away. 25 minutes away. Yeah, I have a really bad track record of driving to meet men in the middle of the woods. What? Tinder stories. What are you talking about? What? Dude? Did you do death wrong? wish? No, because they'll just send me their address, and I can't tell where. And I'm like, yeah, on my way. It was like the time I took 200. Like Park. I took 200 milligrams of edibles and then drove to Low the dose. middle of the woods, and it was really bad. That was a bad time too, because I met a guy on Tinder, and then I found out he knew me from middle school, and like stalked. Me. Anyway, sorry. Hang on, we Different have to go story. back yeah, to go the back, cop cage. The sissy is the best because all the other guys probably aren't sissy. No, he's sissy. Mm-hmm. Big time sissy though. Did you ever oh, yeah. get any like, you know, like cat ears, like maid dress pics? No, I wish because I'm more into that than like the cop cage. So. Well, that this is very funny. This is very Dude, funny. Cop Why? cage is so hilarious <laughs> because it's so because stupid. we've been saying for years that smoking weed turns you into a sissy. <laughs> And it kind of does. It, it kind of does. It totally does. It kind of does. Like my go-to, I've been saying this for probably five years. Oh, dude. Ever since I started smoking this <laughs> weed, James Charles just can't get out of my head. Dude, I've been kicked out of friend groups for it. Not for being for a being sissy. A sissy? No, for no. being a sissy. Yeah. For, no. for <laughs> enjoying James Charles. For, for trying to give up for his spreading butt spreading the word. <laughs> for spreading the word. Spreading dude. the word. Spreading the word. The word Honestly, though, like... I appreciate his honesty, and I appreciate that he was not embarrassed. He just said, here, I'm going to put everything on the table. Before we even roll this joint, I need you to change everything to sissy. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, yeah. Before we even roll this joint. I need you to know. Already. He said, I need you to know <laughs> that I am a sissy. <laughs> That's a modern love story, though. That is a modern love story. Yeah, but then he blocked me on story. everything. Why do you think? 
if you had to really narrow it down, do you think it was you were not think, doing enough on your yeah, part? Yeah, I think I wasn't ready for the sissy lifestyle. Mm. Nowadays, I would have crushed it. Do you think a little sissy is kind of like a, a big, a little sissy is kind of a big problem, do you think? A big project. Uh. Big project, mm. maybe. That's know. a lot of work, right? It is a lot of work. Why do you think it is so much work? Why do you think their problem is? Why, why, do, why can't they be more self-sufficient? Why isn't there a self-sufficient system? Because sissy? their mommies did everything for them. Mm, but what no and now they want the new sissy. mommy. Mommy, can you wear my, my, my cage key on your neck, please, mommy? But so, oh, they call you mommy, but they're sissy. Yeah, they're mommy, sissy. mommy. But what's why are you okay? <laughs> other than obviously the weed is like ninety percent of it. <laughs> what do you think the other ten percent is that's causing like what that's did you causing pick up? sissy? What did you pick up in that situation with this person that made you think like oh yeah there's well there's to a be. lot to unpack there because not only was he a political science major okay. that was <laughs> sick, like there's sure. a lot going on there that I I Politics like we really need to cut we need to shut down this border <laughs> this is insane have you, have you seen these Fox News clips of Dude. all the immigrants and if you could buy me a outfit that'd be great <laughs> that as he's talking about trump like yeah. what yeah well oh and it sounds like this is the other part that i really like about this whole situation is that although he was sissy you were kind of getting financially dominated literally <laughs> that is true that, yeah that, that is so base <laughs> that is so base no but i really like and what's sad is like when he me, I'm, so I'm like what did i i did not do enough for you sissy I'm not. I tried enough. so hard. I didn't do enough for you. You should have. You should have gotten like a friend's phone and texted him. You'll never be enough for this, dummy mommy, you worthless sissy slut. I don't know how. I think I was. It was after high school. This my dark times of Tinder were like age nineteen. So this was like a while ago. So that I just wasn't. Like... I wasn't ready to have a sissy yet. And oh. also now I'm like, you want me to take care of a man. No. I don't even think you could take care of yourself, honestly. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I, all I've had today is coffee, piss. and that's about it. Like, I was on the way here, like, shaking, because all I've had is coffee and piss. You're a right. A lot of piss. Drinking a a lot, lot of piss. piss. She's piss. a piss drinker, you know that? Like, a, a herbal. Piss. Like an herbalist. Shit. Ew. You know those people who drink piss? This is one of those Oh, people. like the dude with the scraggly beard and the bald head? Yeah. Like, the people that have like weird diets and their eyes are sunken in and they're like i'm doing so good on this all i eat is raw meat yeah hey, that's me with piss that's well it sounds like it's not working the i best, do have a piss story as well ew with so a guy if you want that story who pissed on you a guy an ex-boyfriend wow. with oh no God. warning what in a shower oh, oh well maybe it's a goof i wouldn't give um, you a warning no 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 it was not a goof well, how do you know? Did he say call me sissy first? No, he said, get on your knees. And I was like, oh, I'm about to. You You're know. about to slurp. Yeah, face. I'm about to. I'm like, I'm ready for it. Just starts pissing on my face. That's and I'm like fire. this. Bleh, bleh. Yeah. So <sighs> I'm sharing a lot. That's pretty Dude, That is fucking fire. <laughs> That's kind of fucking <laughs> To deep. have the balls and just start pissing. And then I was like, I freaked out. Insane. And he's like. Well, they store the piss in the balls. So. Well, and I said, like, I freaked out. And then he, we had been dating for a while now. And I had no realization that that was happening and then he after i freaked out he looked at me and he was like what i thought you'd like it yeah what's your problem and i was like oh <laughs> sorry <laughs> sorry that is so insane to not even but he ask. ended up being a literal pedophile so oh what? is he in jail no i tried no you didn't yeah i did i went to the police station they said um the girls will have to say something i said oh you want a 12 year old girl to tell their mom to drive them to the police station that's a whole thing. That's uh, another story, guys. Listen, we're trying to stay on well, the legal side of things. Here. Okay, sorry. Let's say to the sissy. Let's say on the sissy. Let's side. say that this is my issue. I think a different Men. drug turns you into a pedophile. What? I don't know, but oh, not not weed. Maybe a piss. What turns you into a pedophile? <laughs> Probably. Probably meth. Probably meth. I saw this video meth. of a meth tweaker. He was like, he was supposed to. You know those videos where it's. Like, Are you talking about the moist critical video of this? I don't know. He might have done a video on it. He did. But there is, you know, those pedo hunters. She can for sure say it without me describing the video at all. I do know pedo, pedo hunters. They're she went. We, it was like this Asian guy yep. in a CVS. Yep. And they were like, "Hey, man, what are you doing here?" <laughs> I'm here. I'm here looking for fiber. I'm but looking I need for shit. fiber. I need to shit, shit right now. Dude, gay dudes love not being able to shit. And then did you see him drive over a median and almost die? Yeah, that was Wait, hilarious. Why do you both know? Why do you <laughs> because know? Because we're besties. We're besties. She sent me the video, though. Yeah. No, he's like, I please stop. But also, did you feel bad for him a little? 
No. I felt bad for him a little. You're gonna have a really hard time finding something this guy's gonna yeah, feel I'll bad never, about. Yeah, I never feel bad. The for guy, people. the I'm like pedo hunter boy, guy, man. is in his face, like this man, and the guy's like crying, laying on the floor, like please leave me alone. Now this is what it was. He walks up, he goes, "So, man, who are you? So, I don't, who are you? Why are you bothering me? <laughs> Why are you bothering me? Stop following me?" me. And what? then the guy goes, so listen, man, we can either get the police involved or you can have a conversation with me. I don't know you. I need my fiber. I need my fiber. Like, I have to shit. Just I let me shit. I just have to shit in so long. Please. I need my fiber. That's was, exactly wait, what like, it Just like that. Like. Was, and why were the police called just because he was tweaking? No, listen. How is this related? To Shut the fuck up. And then the oh guy God. comes in. <laughs> you have to deal with that. Wow. And then the guy comes in. And he starts following. The, the, the Asian guy starts running around the store. I'm dying over here. I'm looking for my fiber. <laughs> and the guy goes, "This guy's here to meet a thirteen-year-old boy what and have picture? sex with him and give him crystal meth." Okay, but my favorite part of that whole story is the security guard comes up to the guy filming and is like, "Dude, get out of here!" Like, whatever. To make him se- to make the guy filming this seem less weird, he's like, "No, but I have a picture of his asshole on my phone." I'm what? like, "Yeah, that's helping your case." Yeah, the security guard walks up to the guy screaming, "This guy's here to meet a third And he goes, "Hey, man, leave him alone or something." He goes. Oh, yeah, if I need to leave him alone, why do I have a picture of his asshole? It's like, Why do what? I have a picture of his asshole then? <laughs> and, then the guy, and then the security guard goes, I don't know. <laughs> He's like, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why you have a picture of his <laughs> asshole. Of the 13-year-old's asshole? No. Uh, <laughs> oh, the, the pedophile. The hunter. pedophile, because he's a pedo hunter, and he tricked him. <laughs> and then the guy sprints out of the store. <laughs> the Asian guy's running as fast as a meth head can. Screaming. Screaming. <laughs> <laughs> Like that on his way out of the fire. store. Yeah, literally, like if he was on fire. You know, you know the scene in Ricky Bobby where he's running yeah, around. Yeah. yeah, just like that. On his way to his car, he gets in his car, cranks it though. He's like, <laughs> right into reverse, hits a, like you know the like areas where there's grass. Yeah, and sometimes there's boulders. Yeah, there's a boulder. And he no, fuck he it. took down a tree like a whole ass Might have been bush. A tree. He just went up. He just went up <laughs> into the air. Hail Hitler. And, so yeah, and then he <laughs> crashed down in the back. Yay. And then he fell down in the Yay. back. And, and then what? And then, going. He, then he then he left. So he got out. But no. On his way out, he then hits a car <laughs> in that park there. The and only car in the parking lot, mind you. One of the, it's like midnight. And then he and then the guy filming goes, Hey man, that's hit and run. Somebody call the cops. Somebody call the cops. And then the cops show up. But before the cops show up, I guess the guy whose car he hit was like leaving the store or something, sees what happens. The guy, the pedophile, jumps out of the car and just starts running. The guy catches him and tackles, tackles he him. He tackled this man, like the pedophile hunter. No, no a the guy, guy whose car though, got hit. You're also, what I love is this guy who's so concerned that this guy is a pedophile has his phone up like this. Someone call the police. You do it. You fucking call the police. <laughs> That's true. He did specifically say though, "I'm already filming, man. You don't gotta film." Yeah, call making the police. sure that other people know what? they don't need to film. <laughs> I, those guys, I hate those guys. I, I hate, I hate it. pedophile I, hunters too. I, it's not, and it's not. It's not helping gets, anyone. No, yeah. See, it's like it's not the fact that I don't. I, you know, I, I don't want pedophiles to be doing their thing. No, we don't want them. I don't like pedophile hunters because I think they're gay. And crazy. I think they're doing it for the attention. I think they're trying to be total like uh, what's Chris what's Hansen. They're like virtue signaling, like look how cool and badass, hey. and look also, how awesome I am. I'm a bone I'm crusher. Jesus. Fun fact: a lot of the times, it doesn't do anything. Like I guarantee that guy just got like reckless. Well, I like, hate pedophiles though. And I gotta run. show him. Yeah, he probably just got charged with hit and run because a lot of times too, there has to be someone that can testify against it, and they're not gonna take. Them. Well, I I told him I was thirteen, <laughs> and he still wanted to meet me. They're like, sir, you're 49. Like, that don't guy, care. That guy's job is to get those people to say sorry to me in my bed eating hot chip at like four in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I already have to pee really bad. Are you serious? It's okay. I'm going to hold it. Okay, for sure. Can I pee in this chair? No. Only oh. when I get under the chair. Then okay, well. <laughs> Great. You got to call him a sissy, though. <laughs> okay, cool. You got to hold I have experience, my cage, so. My key to the cage. I can't believe that that happened to you. Is that, like. I have a lot of stories. In ter- okay. you, I could come on. I have a lot of stories. In terms of. Yeah. Sissy, that's got to be, like, the top, right? That's, like, the pinnacle. Of my stories? Yeah. In hilarity. In, in hilarity. Fun. Yeah, in terms of funny. Not there like, might be more outrageous. But or... more like, this is outrageous. Yeah. This is stupid. 
Yeah. That was hilarious. That is so funny. You I've told had me that, and I was, like, dying for 15 minutes straight. I, I can't know. imagine it I've being a real thing. It is. There's a lot well, of them. I can imagine. I can imagine in the internet world where it's like, oh, this is his Discord kitten or vice versa. But then, like, the fact that you met up, you rolled this joint up, and then he's like, hey, stop. And he puts his, he's like, stop. And then hey. she's like, what? Hey. You need to call me sissy. <laughs> you want to know something fun? What? I guarantee he's still in my phone under the name sissy. You're kidding. I don't change anything. I don't delete any. Let's some, uh, find out. If it is, you have to pull the contact up and show the camera, and then we'll bleep the number out. It says sissy. Uh, it's too small, whatever. It says sissy right we'll there. We'll believe it. Does it say sissy? It does say sissy. You can sissy, see it. Sissy, that's him. Oh, my God. Hey, it's all that it says, too. That's my old too. number. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, wait a minute. Fuck. That's all it says, too. Sissy, yeah. No contact picture. No contact picture because if I were to put a contact picture for him, the only pictures I had were... His asshole. Booty hole. I, and his cock, cock in a cage. W- okay, well, cute? now, was it feminine? Was it a feminine cock? Feminine penis. <laughs> was it a feminine penis? That's, like, um, our thing out here. Yeah, we I love feminine penis. You know what? I, I have a hot take. All in. Any soft cock is, is a feminine penis to no. me. What if not it's every, huge? not everyone. What if it's ginormous? Our soft cocks are very feminine, but <laughs> there's some hung men out there. Someone's Mine's say inverted. Not. I know your is insane. Huge, I know. Perfect. I have to tuck it back. Um, well, James does that, and he's cool. She has to whoop it. Whoop, gangster that shit. Oh, okay, for sure. Okay, cool. Um, what? I don't remember what we were talking about. It's something about sissy. You were saying, oh, you think oh like, did he have a feminine? Oh Again, so feminine any, I think if it's a soft cock in a cage, it comes off as feminine. I, nice. But I've seen some feminine penises, I will say. That had to be the most feminine. Yeah, I mean, it's a shock. Did it have a pink bow on the cage? No, I wish. <laughs> that would have made it so much more fun. What a fucking amateur. Yeah, yeah, did you think he would have shown up? And I'm really fun. sad. <laughs> it didn't even work. <laughs> yeah, right. Get this thing off of me! <laughs> <laughs> it's to his secret diary instead. Um, I really wish he didn't block me on Discord because I can't find anything, and I would love to be able to find, like, everything he sent me. Because it was all through Discord. Actually, no, I probably don't have the text anymore. There How were some texts. How many people do you have on Discord just like, ba 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 not as many anymore. I block a lot of people. Okay, this is actually a great transition into, like, what is a blockable offense to one of these. Because, like, I have a, a feeling that what you're dealing with is, like, the depths of people on the internet. Like, you're dealing well, with, like... I, show bobs. I show am, bobs. You're dealing with show bobs, Yeah. Dude. <laughs> um, I've had a lot of very strange requests. Um, very strange. I think this is a perfect time for you to get into those, but first... I think we need to preference this. I, I'm i not kidding. Dead ass thought you were going to be like, first, a commercial break. And I was like, oh. <laughs> <Athletic> <laughs> Thank <greens>. you for <laughs> Audible for our use code Bunky while, to get three months free. You know what? And while she's here, let's talk about better help. <laughs> <laughs> that you would be, we would make you do it. Yeah, yeah exactly. It would be Perfect. you like writing crayons on the wall, like tearing <laughs> your hair out. It's not working. It's not working. <laughs> Nothing's working. That's, <laughs> that's me every night. <laughs> So I also did say I was going to smoke before I came on here, so I was a little more chill, and I did not. So, now so you're, you're getting on. full. No, this is actually manic. great. This full is crazy. This is going great. This is awesome. This is going way better than expected. Oh, oh, this is the best. Oh, better than expected. Well, I was. Thinking oh, too. see, this guy's such a fucking dick. So like, you why thought, would he even say that? So you thought it wouldn't be? I, I wouldn't be fun to have. I on. thought it was going to flop oh, for sure. You're going to shoot this oh. guy in his fucking head. This dude is such a girl. Fucking come fucker. on, definitely going to flop. Man, why'd you even message me? <laughs> no, I didn't say that. Dude, oh. You're such a dickhead, dude. We're gonna see, have now. And this have, is why it should be just us two. Oh uh, well, I was going to uh, be the producer role. So the one. truth comes out. <laughs> Hey, Eddie, can you go ahead and oh, God, can you go work the computer while the real talent? Dude, Who's Eddie? Eddie's this guy. He's Eddie a was our one-time uh, one time producer for our hit. We had a hit single. Mo- we did a movie. I don't think you've seen it. It's three no. and a half hours so long. Good. It's actually really funny. It is really good. Okay. Sh- and uh, this is kind of part two to the movie, actually. Oh, perfect. It's going to be superimposed. It's, uh, we've got a few titles we're looking at. Uh, Men are pigs. Uh, That's true, though. Two sides of the same coin. I like that one. Yeah, okay. Ying yang. I hate all of them, but. You're not bringing much, so chill out. Okay. But, <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, this one guy we had. He, Eddie. 
No, 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 oh. no. Fuck Eddie. I thought we were talking about Eddie. Well, no, Eddie's fuck involved. Eddie. Fuck okay, Eddie. Him. sorry. We him. Eddie. We hate him. We don't like Eddie. Eddie, your girlfriend's fucking ugly, but... She's not the best. She uh. looks like a beaten dog, dude, but... It's okay. Fuck you, Eddie. You know what scares me, though? What if there are people out there that say that about me? There are. There's probably <laughs> people out there. There are. Like, I'm one of them. <laughs> listen. Why listen. did you have this beaten, beaten dog lookalike come about on the show? Boyfriend, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, okay. you should hear what I say about his boyfriend. But <laughs> your boyfriend? Anyway, his boyfriend. Yeah, my boyfriend. Who's your boyfriend? He's, you know, he's a He's more of like a work husband. I don't think okay. their relationship's very real. Just because if you are in a relationship with somebody you work with, it's kind of like... Yeah, for sure. Do you have a girlfriend? I have a boyfriend. I have a, he has a trans I have a trans girlfriend. boyfriend. Okay. Female presenting, but it's kind of like female presenting. Okay, let's not... Well... <laughs> let's chill. I mean, he's not... This is something that we, we've talked about this kind of a lot. This is, but anyway, this <laughs> part one. This guy who was on part one, our guest, our great okay. guest. He also happened to be trans. No, <laughs> this guy. He's, there were some people though. He's a lunatic. He's mentally ill. He has no concept on reality. You're describing me. He is a schizophrenic. You're describing me still. So this is why we thought it'd be perfect to. Oh, it'd be perfect to have you on the show, because this would be perfect to he's, have because he was a simp. Who donated I love my Sims. He donated thousands. 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 Are you sure he is not one of mine? Yes. We're sure. Okay. No, we've deep dive 100%. We would okay. know. We've asked him some questions. Okay. Because I have sim- some guys who send me large amounts of money. No, he's not sending large amounts of money all at once. It's, it's, this is it, a, it's oh. more of like a buck shot. Yeah. Kind of, or no, a you bird should- shot. Kind of you know what? He's probably like this one simp I have right now who he sends me like every morning I wake up and it says twenty five dollars and I'll say for coffee and then for lunch, like I get money. So it's probably that. That's how he gets up to like lots of money. That's what sick. are you drinking? Twenty five dollars worth of coffee? Then. He just thinks I need twenty five dollars for coffee. That is so sick. You know what? <sighs> I want to say something, but then if he sees this, that would be really sad. How is he gonna see it? That's well. Just don't tell him. He won't know. Okay, but a lot of times I'll be like. I'm really hungry. Do you think you could send me some money? He'll send me money. Oh, that's what's funny. I that's never a, eat. That's a classic. That is a classic. He would fall. Do you also want to know a yeah, fun scheme ahead. I have as well? Yes. I love this. I say, guys, can someone pay for me to get my nails done? It's like $75. And then they send me the money. And then I glue on fake nails I no, already have. No, we've seen that. Yeah. We've seen that on your Instagram thing. Yeah. That's, that is so hard. I love yeah. that. That is funny, actually. Yeah. Because I remember... You know, when we were talking, you asked me a hilarious question that immediately okay. made me laugh because the guy I was talking about came to mind. We okay. call him Big Dan, Schmike, whatever you want to call him. Wait, okay. You big Dan. Know. Okay. Are you he's sure? Not, he's not that big. I know the mic you're thinking of. He was huge. Not that big. Okay. You see, he's ginormous. Okay. Like a balloon. Like a like hot a air huge, balloon. Like a brick wall. Like a blimp. Like a zeppelin. Like a zeppelin. <laughs> 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 All right. But this guy. What were you saying? That's all. Uh, Big Dan Big donates Dan money. Donates to money to donates women. money. Thousands of dollars. I said something to you that was hilarious. Oh yes, 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 yes. As I do. You as as always. Yeah. You came with something hard hitting and witty. You per said. Oosh. You you go. Uh, I just don't get it. Like, here, would you ever message a oh, girl yeah. you found on the internet, expecting to go on a date with her? And I just burst out laughing because this guy we had on. Literally would think that. Yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. 100 million yeah. No, percent. the amount of men that find me on TikTok or something like that, and the first well, message. anymore. What? Oh, yeah, aren't you banned anymore. on TikTok or something? Fucking, I, it's a sore subject. Okay, we'll get into that later. We'll get into that because I'm really fucking pissed off on that. It's not my fault. Anyways, so the amount of men that find me on TikTok or Instagram, whatever, the first message, just one date. Just give me one date. And I literally said to this guy, I said, we probably live in different countries. Just, I'll fly you out. I'll fly you out. I'll fly you You'll out. fly me out. You probably live in your mom's basement. You're going to fly me out. You think you would have a better chance, too, with some other brownie, you know? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the bobs, mom. <laughs> but, yeah, no. It's, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying, if he's going to give you 5 million yeah. rupees to show up, you That's think. That's true. Yeah, no. But yeah, no, they they think that. The simps come in hot. Or the guy, okay, do you want a f- good one? The pay pigs? I love my pay pigs. Yes. I love that one. <laughs> Dude, yes. The way 
that it's so easy to manipulate men for money. Well, so Especially schizophrenic That's the reason idiots. I haven't wanted to die yet. Oh, I man. Love, I love manipulating women for money. So true. It's so insane casino how much money. Casino time. It's so insane how much money I get Literally to go all to my casino. exes. <laughs> it's casino Manip- time. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, that's where you learned it from. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that's, okay. You're taking the power Girlies. back. Girlies. Girlies. As if there's a girl listening to this besides me. Um, there's a couple. Okay. A couple ugly ones. Talking about me again? No, his bulldog that he calls a <laughs> wife. Okay. Oh, my God. I've literally never seen her, so. Okay. Um, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I can't move on. See, now you're making me paranoid. Why? You, you haven't now I'm sitting like five here. Minutes? No, I'm sitting here, and I'm like. <laughs> okay. True. Honestly, true, though. Very true. I almost had a sentient thought there for a second. Yeah, no. I sucks. literally cannot be sober. Um. I hate being so. I be so okay. Sorry. <laughs> oh, fuck you guys. This is going well though. I, I know, can you stop commenting on how this is going well? It's I going told sh- you this guy's such a dick. Like, what is he saying? Fuck, we're having this, this guy is dumb just mentally bitch fucking on the show. <laughs> um, no, dude, literally, that's what it was like before you. <laughs> dude, dude, are you sure this fucking dumb bitch is gonna keep up with us? <laughs> we're comedic genius. Like, cunt. she's kind of in the slow lane. We're here doing hundred miles an hour. This bitch is gonna pull over like a damn grandma. I am in the slow lane, but... Pay pigs. Still funny. Pay pigs. You love them. I do love them. What else was I going to say, though? About the pay pig. I was saying, girlies, the Mm. life hack cheat is the way your exes treated you like shit and made you pay for everything, take that, learn from it, and do it to men. All right, my girlfriend definitely cannot watch this video. Yeah, (laughs) for sure. (laughs) Yeah, it works. she's going to stop giving me money. They want... The way that pay pigs, men on the internet... They want you to treat them like human garbage. Mm, it's insane. So it blew my mind. Dude, I love seeing tweets that are like just the bottom of women's feet. Just <gasps> woke up, pay pigs, and my feet are dirty. Give me money to clean them. Or you can just lick them so, off yourself. I had uh, I had a guy that messaged me and said, how much for you to send me some feet pics? And I, I told him the amounts and whatever. And he said, I need them to be... Like, I need there to be space above your head. I want it vertical. And I was like. I love that. <laughs> I was like, okay, what's up? And he's like, well, it's got it. I need it for my phone background. And then he did send me pictures. I am this man. Like, full on iPhone phone background, just like me. Like, like what? Like, also, like, how, where, how can you just, like, have that as your phone background? Or why you is my question, because there's so many people, you know? Like, there's so many people doing it. You're about to so, murder like, this guy. So, like, you're pretty ugly. So, why you? Like, honestly, it's <laughs> there's been so a really... Many, there's so many girls to choose from. I'm just not getting why you. That's not what I meant. I okay. Meant, this looks like a broom in front of me. <laughs> and <laughs> these guys are paying you? I just mean if you go, like... You look to, like Plank from Ed and Nettie. I think so it's... how are you getting all this money? <laughs> True. It, it, to be honest, I think it's... The men that are into feet or very specific kinks or stuff like that, if they find, <laughs> I just had, I just had a oh brain blast. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, uh, if they find a girl that they like on my TikTok, they would find me. I think they just like, oh, I like this girl's face or I like this girl. Now I need to like, it's like a fixation where they're like, now I need to see your feet. Do you think it's like a live thing? And too? I got huge feet. Sorry. Like, do you think it's because you spend so much time on live? Maybe. I think it's the low cut shirts that I wear every single time, but you know. <laughs> it's the bobas. <laughs> yeah, what size the, feet? Oh, I have big feet. 14 basketball men's. 14 men's would be 14 crazy. Men's. Look at my feet. They're big. <laughs> look at my feet. <laughs> no, dude, that's the thumbnail. Know, look yeah. at, <laughs> look know, at my feet. I know. Look at my feet. No, <laughs> I wear a size 10 in women's. That's, that's not big. crazy. But that's yeah. big feet. That's big Nine feet. Nine in men's isn't insane, but compared to most men, I would say it's pretty so, crazy. I do. We. I just need to know about the pay pigs. Then we go to the the thing. That to my, okay. Okay. To okay. Like, w- I mean, I wanted. Uh, is there a polite way of asking? Like, are there people out there that are like, you know, the big Kahuna? Are they like? What do you mean? Like, you know, they're dropping the check. Yeah. Why? Oh, you got the big daddy gorilla grip. I had someone send me over five hundred dollars, and they said, like, this is just one example, and literally the caption was, "Spoil yourself." That was it. Do you think he's like a quadriplegic? Um. Wait, what was your response to that? Dude? What was it? Oh my god! Thank you so much. You have no idea how much this means to me. You probably had somebody else send that to him too, right? Yeah, right. So you have a. <laughs> you had your sissy type it out. Okay. For you. 
moderator is a, a good thing about the TikTok thing because I want to talk about that. Mod- Someone told me I need moderators for my lives. With my audience, who the fuck am I going to choose as moderators? Dangling Wang 69. Yes. Because I trust him. I trust him. Like, who the <laughs> fuck am I going to have to mod my TikTok? I don't know. Anyways. For su- somebody who constantly is saying, like, I'm crazy, I'm crazy, you're kind of with it when you're talking about, like, what's going on in a way. Dude, no, she is the most. <laughs> I'm a no, girl boss. <laughs> dude, she is the most awake person I've ever, like, talked to in a really long time. Because most people have some kind of weird misconception of the life they're living and, like, what's going on in a day-to-day. But she's just so, like, with it. You're in tune. So, you know what it is? I had many therapists, um, especially in high school. Did it, either of you have the M- Mr. Ball as a, like, counselor guy? No, but anyways, we're gonna I want to keep it vague. <laughs> oh, yeah, sorry. I'm not supposed to say that shit. Um, <laughs> anyways, he literally looked at me. He's like, you know, you just really know what your problems are, but you just don't fix them. And I'm right. like, yeah, see, I'm like with it. Like, I know what's wrong. Like, but I just let the crazy go, like, live. Why? No, I wouldn't have said that. Gives me personality. For sure. That, that's you true. know how much unfunny. Well, I know you don't think I'm very funny, but. It's actually, so far, so good. <laughs> oh my God, thanks. <laughs> um, you know how unfunny I would be if I was, like, medicated or tried not to. Like, I share everything because it's fun. Dude, it gives me personality. No, I mean, trust me. We The guy that we were talking about that we had on before <laughs> this that we did the movie with, he got super medicated, and now he's not funny anymore. Yeah, exactly. Uh, they want me to go on ADHD medication. I said, no. Yeah. This is my personality. All you do Fuck. is you just, big pharma, I've got dude. my meds right here. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Except my lungs don't work anymore, so. Hell yeah. That's cool. We know somebody who burnt out their lungs on Wayne. Well, I have, like, major asthma issues and then used those, like, street carts for, like, three years that probably had pesticides in them. And now if I even hit a cart, it's like I'm about to have to go to the hospital because I can't breathe. Like a Fortnite cart or, like, a yeah, yeah, yeah. South cart? Like a Supreme, Supreme cart. cart? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Supreme carts are the hot diggity dog. <laughs> those did hit, dude. <laughs> dude, I remember it was 2019. I ripped the blinker on the, the I Supreme cart. I hate that term. Blinker? Ripped the blinker? Everyone in Discord. Guys, should I rip a blinker? Shut ripped. the fuck up. Well, you're using Discord. Yeah, that's, that's where autistic. That's two losers who play League. Oh, I was just about to say, you're going to hate on Discord, Mr. League player. Dude, League. First of all, let me get the camera on me real quick. League players are the biggest degenerate sissies on planet <laughs> Earth. They're sissies. Have As you, you are- ever met a League player that plays the game every day? They are the most disgusting, unkept, unhygienic. Why are you talking about yourself like that? You've ever met. And they're sissies. And sissies. I'm a level 7 mastery, 144 mastery points on level Urgot. Hell yeah. That's like one of my biggest rules. Like, if I'm going to date anyone, they cannot be a League player. And they can't be a sissy. They what? can be. Oh, they could? So yeah. you'd rather have that. She's a dummy mommy, dude. I'd weird. rather have a sissy than a league player. That's because league players just probably don't pay attention to you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay, QQR. They have, like, bed sores on their ass from playing all day. <laughs> bed sores. E auto W E Q R. But. Oh, bed sores. They do got some fast fingers. I'll give them that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> league players? Sorry. All right, so if you've got these... These, okay. You've got these pay pigs running around. Yeah. And pay pigs, you know, they got specific things they like. You know, some pay pigs are into this, some pay pigs are into that. Yeah. Have you ever seen or thought about or explored any Vore content? I don't know what that means. You don't know what Vore is. Vore, no. interesting. Well, there was a girl, or sorry, there was a them okay. that went to our school. My apologies. And uh, they. Uh, yeah. Don't guess. Okay, but I know, yeah. They were doing Vore content on okay. OnlyFans. And, you know, I'm big, I've, I'm have i an internet historian. I've been on the internet since I was like 12 or 13. Yeah, my favorite Twitch sub. Yeah, and a long time Twitch sub. I'm all over Twitch. Yep. I'm a per, uh, professional online troll. Okay. Oh, yeah, he is. <laughs> Great. But, uh, where was I going? What is Vore content? Vore content. This woman, she was great at it. She. I probably know what it is. It. I just don't know what the term is. Can you guess first? Wait, yeah, I want to see if she... Guess. I have no clue. Oh, okay. Well, that was uneventful. Vore okay. is when you pretend the camera is a miniature human. Oh, and, my God. And then I you eat I fucking them. love that. Yes. Or like, I'm going to eat you. Oh, little my God. Loach. I should do that. Where you stick out your belly a little and, like, grab it. And then you go... Mm. I'm I a big giant, and I'm going to eat you. I haven't eaten since, like, 9 o'clock. 
pack this morning. I'm so hungry. I've got I've got such an empty belly, and I need it to be full. With a little bit more bass in your voice, though. Yeah, yeah. Could you fill it up for me? <laughs> That's better. Um, yeah, I actually have never even seen that before. I th- and I've never been asked to do anything like that. Mm. I do have a guy that I had to block. Made new accounts. I've blocked him like seven times. Because That's this guy. He, he, he would make accounts yeah. and harass him to go ahead. What was that guy? You know, he asks the same. He'll send me the same messages, but then delete them. And then send them again. The thing he asks me constantly, which I don't understand it, is, do you litter? Do you litter? <laughs> He'll send it over and over again. Do you litter? Do you throw trash on the ground? Do you litter? I do litter. I don't get it. Do you I litter? I don't. What? It, and then he did. He also asked me to like. He wanted a video of me like stomping my feet into dirt. So I'm like, does he just like filth? But like, he. I don't get <laughs> littering. If the thought of me throwing a piece of plastic on the ground is like his holy grail. But I do don't you know get if it. it is? Like, do you know if, well, what if he's asking because he's trying to like get you? He's trying to. Report I you. did answer. I think once and was like, no, because I was just like over it. I love wrong answer. I know. Boring. He blocks you. <laughs> he's like, oh fuck. Um, and I think he just like kept asking. I don't know. It was. Have you littered weird. this week? <laughs> have, you, then, have you littered recently? That's so uh, funny. My freaking hog's gonna explode. But this, I don't get it. So this them was making this comment. Will you tell me who it is after? Yes. yes. Okay. And then, uh, unfortunately, they had to go to a mental institution and they deleted all their accounts. I also did accounts. though. So. But it was very recent, so they had oh. to get. They like went dark. It's zero not dark like 30. you stop them. A lot of our guests have gone on mental. You know. Yeah, I mean, oh, it checks out. All. It checks out. And I actually be in the pen. went to a mental institution during high school and then came back after a few months. And I remember a specific person who you know looked at me and said, oh, my God, I haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? Class went silent. And I went, I tried to kill myself. <laughs> and the teacher literally was like, the teacher's like, okay, class, why don't we move it on? And oh. that, guess what? That's when I lost all my friends and no one ever talked to me again. But guess what? And then you started now stomping around. And then you started go stomp, stomp, And then yeah. you started eating people. And then I started, wait, were we talking about me? I yeah. think so. With what? Boar. Well, we were saying if you knew what it was because we we know somebody who does know what it is. I, I got that part. Such a I, got that part. I have to pee so bad. All right, do it, do it. No, it's okay. I'm holding it. Okay, so I'm Vor, Vor is a very, very name, fine line between Vor and feederism and mukbangs. So this 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 master was tiptoeing back and forth in the both minefields. I. So what are your thoughts on that? How as another lo- disclose, I as another local have been. Um, I do not do. F- I haven't had anyone want me to be a feeder for them, Feedy. but I've I've had a lot of feeders men be like, "What did you? How much have you been eating lately?" <laughs> And this guy messaged me. This guy messaged me like two weeks ago and was like, man, love the weight you're putting on. Yeah. And I literally was like, I'm going to kill myself now. <laughs> he was like, you've been eating. What have you been eating lately? Because you're really putting it. And I'm like, I'm going to jump in front of a train. So <laughs> that is like, so. <laughs> you've been eating lately. You've been ballooning. <laughs> literally. They will message me on. Re- it's mostly Reddit. Why you think so? Well, I know why, but I really, I would, I can't say why. You don't, why, but why? I was posting on a specific Reddit. Oh, was it like yeah. giant getting super fat eating food? <laughs> no, uh, it was like a sexual Reddit that okay. I was just, because I'm not like a, th- a thin girl. I, I'm what they call medium sized. Um, So I would post on that because I got a lot of like subs from that and stuff. But then it got bad. Because people were messed. Oh my god, you're getting like, we're huge, getting honey. And I'm like, I'm going <laughs> off myself. Stop <laughs> calling me fat. <laughs> it's so bad. So I've kind of distanced myself from the feeder community. Oh, uh, so th- that's the problem then, because the feeders and the vores go hand in hand. What if the guy that sends me money for food every day Wants is just get- a feeder? Yeah, he probably, probably is. He probably is. Yeah. That's why I think. Or he cares. About you know, him. obviously, I don't know anything, <gasps> but maybe you should tip, tip your toe and. See, I tip my toe into everything. See, see if anybody wants to buy you every item on McDonald's. That's true. I do tip my toe into a lot of, a lot of different fields. Do you think you, if somebody was like, because you're doing your nails thing, where you're like, I need yeah. to get my nails painted today. Why don't you do this thing where you're like, I need to buy every single item on the McDonald's menu, and it or costs fifty eight dollars or whatever it costs. Please, I'll post the video. 
And then all you got to do is record one, one video, video and take like 25 different videos from that one video. Yeah. And just like move the food around. And go, I just got this. Son. Oh, that's what I do all the time. You have to wear hats like and stuff though. Or yeah. Change your shirt. <laughs> oh, literally. No, it's weird. And it is weird because if I posted like, guys, I'm really struggling with my rent. I really need help. Not a single soul will send me money. Not a single soul. Well, that's funny. Yeah. Fucked up. They're, they're, they're like, get out, get they're like we don't them. care. Can you send us a picture of your tits? We do not care. Well, they're like, we want you to live with us. So oh my God, we need you on perfect. the street. <laughs> we need you there so I can save you. I have something crazy that happened to me recently, but I don't, I'll tell you guys after. But um, what was I going to say? But yeah, no, but they will send me money if it's like a very specific. I really, most of my, I would say 90% of the people that follow me and come for me are like daddy types. Well, it sounds like people are more interested in giving you money for anything that involves, like, grooming yourself in any sort of way. Yeah, it's... Oh, because <laughs> they're like, you need it. You need it. You're a wreck. <laughs> go get your nails done. Here, go. Hopefully this guides you in the right direction. Yeah, can you go to Sephora or something? Like, have someone help you out. No. They probably wouldn't give you money for, like, a therapist, though. No. no. They will never help me with, like, actual life. A physical really. trainer, maybe. <laughs> yeah, they would. Or if they're training you how to eat more. Yeah, that's true as well. <laughs> a stomach trainer. Yeah. No, most of them are like daddy, Baba. daddy like types that are like, oh, they all have beer bellies and small cocks. Every single one. And they show you them? Oh, yeah. I get a lot oh, of small cocks. I should show you. Well, maybe not on this, obviously. But there's one guy that sends me them like every day. And his penis is so weird looking. Ew. Is, is it, it like Epstein? skinny and then the head's huge? Or what? No, it's like it curves this way like a lot. Yeet. But he has, like, I think he has, like, um... What? Cerebral palsy? No, what's that disease? <laughs> Sorry. What's that disease where your, like, skin is different colors? Autism. Oh, propecia. Or no, alopecia. <laughs> no, alopecia is where your hair falls out. Oh, he's got that thing where, like, the black dude's got it. Like, the... Oh, it's, where like, where like you have a lack of, like, melanin or something in your... Oh, he's, like, black. So and it looks like a spotted cow. He's got patchy... I kind of like seeing it. He's got patchy dick. Yeah, it's kind of fun to look at. Uh, and he sends it to you every day. Does he have to pay you to send it to you? No, he'll send them to me, and then I'll be at work, so I don't answer. And then he'll send me, no time to get me off? Question mark. I'm like, no, oh. I don't have time to get you off. Maybe send for me a seventy-five. Tip. Yeah, I'm like, send me some money, and then. Then I'll clear out fifteen minutes, yeah. or I pretend to eat you, and then we'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. Do you think you would stomp around for somebody though, and let them like you know? Yeah. You're like oh. I'll be one thousand percent honest. There's not many things I won't do, for money. Well, that sounds just kind of bad. Besides, like, I don't like the piss and shit stuff. Well, what? So that one time. You said you were very expertise in that field. <laughs> I do love pissing, pissing, but. Here, this is a question. I have to pee so bad. Here, okay. go. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. No, 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 go, go, go. Yeah, go but that go, is, go, like, go. so much work. No, no, it's no work. It's, it's my fun. work. It really is no work. Are there people upstairs? Probably. No. But it's right there. It's like, yeah, it's like right I, there. I'm going to be embarrassed. It's like right there. Just take just, your sunglasses just, off. I don't see better. anything to them. Don't worry. I, I literally. Release. Well, you could, you but it might, you might feel more embarrassed. Hi. <laughs> no, don't say anything to them, though. Hey. <laughs> Unless he says hi, then you can say hi. No. I, 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 all right, just go. No, no, I'm going to hold it. I'm going to hold it. But now I want to go. I have to pee so bad. Just go. Go. I'm going to go. On my way here, I had to pee a little bit, and then I relaxed a little bit, and then a little pee came out. All right, just go. Wait, don't tell me that. All right, fine, fine, fine. You okay. saw it on the way in here, so it'll be no, fine. No, but where is it? You'll see it. You'll see it. I'm going to I'm gonna stop. I don't like cats. Oh, I don't like these ones. You it's should hear what this guy does to dogs. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, what? <laughs> anyway, back to eating a lot. I'm an absolute pig. I just love stuffing my face and just being as gluttonous as I can. I'm so happy for you. It's really bad over the last three weeks. I actually have been birthday. binge eating really bad lately. Oh, me too. Like, really, really yeah. bad. Like I Something wake in up, the air. Like, I wake up and almost throw up from the binge that I had the night before. Yeah. I do that sometimes. Sometimes I, like, it's fun to, like, eat till it hurts. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. Then, and then you forget to enjoy it. Oh, I never enjoy it. That's what no, we No, I we, never oh, enjoy it. Oh, oh, never enjoy oh. it. And then I'm like, what did I even order? Yeah. Like, yeah. I'm like 80% of the way through the meal, yeah. choking and stuffing it down my gullet. And then I go, wait, did I, in, did I even like that? Yeah. Was well, that even good? Yeah. It's a lot harder to, like, I'll my literally, day? if I just post, like, I want ice cream, I'm going to get, like, 15 DoorDash dairy, like, people will be like, let me send you some. So that's the problem, too. It's how easy I can... Well, they're going to send you Because then I'm not even paying. Aren't they knowing where you live then? No, no, no. They'll just send me money for DoorDash. Oh. Uh, yeah. uh, Someone wanted to send me flowers on Valentine's Day, and they're like, there's no way. I'm like, how? Like, I don't know how I would do that. 
without giving away my location. So I was like, no. And they were like mad about it. Well, They're you, like, there's no way I can't send it to a P.O. box. I'm like, I don't have a P.O. box. You should get a P.O. box. I know. You're going to need a P.O. box. No, because then I'm going to get like sent like used condoms and shit, and I don't want that. Why would they be using it on, though? Well, they're going to send a video of them contributing. Yeah. Into a condom. Into a condom. Got it. Yeah. And then, like, smacking the used condom on the picture of her that they printed out. <laughs> <laughs> the picture, their, like, phone background of my feet. <laughs> That's crazy. That they printed out. Yeah. That is insane. That is insanity. Not really. What's insanity is what this guy did. Fucking. Oh, that's true. That we'll he, show you that. But he Sorry. took it farther. Like he was trying to meet these women. Like he's most trying of to, them are. Like he was trying to buy. He's, he's like, oh, she's like, oh yeah, I need you to send me two hundred bucks. And he goes, okay, but when you show up, you're gonna blow me, right? Yeah, yeah. That's then, a lot of them. I think a lot of it is they kind of think you're an escort, and it's like, mm-hmm. no, I'm just doing this on the internet. Yeah, and I think that's what they don't get is like a lot of them. Like he would literally go to a restaurant, and she's like, "Oh my god, I need gas money to get there." Yeah, can you give me fifty bucks? And he goes, yeah, "Okay, I think though, so. I don't know, I don't know." <laughs> Here you go, and then gives, and now it's like three hundred bucks in the last two days. She's not gonna show up, guys. No, I don't know how many times you got to hear this. They're not showing up. No, they're you not. You look I'm like taking, shit. I'm taking your money, and I'm running. I did have a guy, so I used to be on a sugar daddy website that was based on, like, how close you were are, like, proximity. What's yeah. that called? I actually don't remember the name of it. It was a while ago. Um, there's literally stuff like sugarbaby.com, like, tons like of eight years ago. Go daddy. <laughs> um, he, so, there was this one guy on there, Dan, and. Big Dan. Dan. Dude, he keeps coming up. Yeah, Dan would message me daily, please just, I just please, I'll pay you as much as you want. I just need you to cuddle me. Just big spoon me. Please, Aww. please, please. And I would say, no, like, I'm not comfortable with that, whatever. That You're like, I want to be the little spoon. And when I say this was five years ago, this was five years ago, he still, every month, subs to my OnlyFans, messages me. Please, I know, I know you live close. Just please. And I'm like, Dan, it's not going to happen. And then he'll unsub because he's mad. And then he'll come back every, like, two months and be like, please, I just want you to cuddle me. We don't have to do anything else. That is, I believe him too. Oh yeah, he just wants and but like, can you imagine? I guarantee I would cuddle him. He'd start crying. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, physical and, touch might and then be too he'll much. Lift up his skirt and he'll be in a cage. God, kids. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. See, no, um, the yeah. keys in my ass. How Literally. many of these people? Okay, but so the person that we're talking about, this big yeah. dad fellow, he'll get into situations where he'll meet girls on Tinder or he'll he'll meet girls on Hinge, yeah. and they will be presenting themselves as an escort sort of where they'll be like we are somebody that you can meet in person okay and then he'll be like oh sick this girl likes me and every time i would have been like no she hates you she's not even a girl yeah literally and then and then he'll be like no no she likes me this time for real i'm getting pussy i'm getting pussy this time look she sent me a video of her getting fucked by another dude that means she's totally (laughs) gonna blow me me. that means she's gonna blow me um i it's really, like, most of the men think, even if, like, I'm very open about, I'm I'm only on the internet. Like, I am an internet person. Like, you're not going to get anything from me in person. You're an influencer. Shut the fuck up. But they will still. <laughs> very successful, too. They will, true. They will act. Oh, nice. Like, we are, a lot of, you know what I specialize in mostly? is GFE, which is oh, the girlfriend, girlfriend experience. experience. Oh, okay, I didn't know that, man. Yeah, so GFE is girlfriend experience. I know BFE. Fucking rookie. <laughs> BFE. What's the BFE? Boyfriend experience. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's versed. You're living it. You're living He's it. He's versed. Um, so that's kind of like my niche. And like most of them treat me like I am their girlfriend. Like as if we're going to meet someday. Kind of like, hey, babe, how's your day doing? Yes. Or- all the time. I really hope you're not stressed today. I know how, I know how you get overwhelmed. And I'm <sighs> like, yeah, you know what helped? 50 bucks. Oh, my God. I'm so stressed. How am I going to get it? home from work i'm literally stranded i ran out of gas right when i fucking pulled in i need it. i need money i'm, I'm gonna out. be fucking dead i'm out of money <laughs> please gonna... help me please yeah no but i do know that there's a lot of girls that do that and most only fans creators GFE. portray a single and are not oh i see i'm not saying that's what i do obviously um, not I would never do that. Um, that's fucked up, honestly, if women are doing that. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's Do not illegal. lie to us simps out there. Amaranth did that forever, and you love her. Amaranth. I do love Amaranth. I hate Amaranth. 
I love her. And then she came out that she has a crazy husband that like tried to fake. That's go fake. Crazy. fake. I feel like it was fake too. Um, I think it was just like she broke up with her boyfriend. I probably wasn't and even had her a husband. meltdown and was like, "I'm gonna be famous. I want more money." Yeah, I don't know. Okay, wait. But they, so they're bolted on her. Our our guy, Big Dan. Yeah. He would love to know. Like he didn't ask me this specifically to ask yeah. you, but he would love to know. There's all these guys. There's a pool of guys yeah. that are giving you money. They're like giving you. You're giving them the GFE. They're like, I need you. I need yeah. you. What would he be able to do to stand out and really make a difference and like make you in your mind think for even just a split second? Send like, me more money. Really, that's it. Yeah, that's it. There's nothing that you like. Is there? There's no emotional connection he could give you. There's nothing he could possibly give you to make you be like, maybe this guy is a good, good guy. Maybe I should give this guy a shot. Not really. I've had guys where we've like talked, and I've been like, wow, this is actually like a like cool dude. Like it could be all like just fake for the internet, whatever. But I've been like, oh, this is a cool dude. But I would never, never. We can't if they be that start, cool. Yeah, if they start sending me like a ton, a ton, a ton of money, then maybe I'd be like, yeah. Like you know five what? figures at yeah. least, right? I'd be like, like yeah, you're cool. Like l- probably literally like at least ten thousand, right? Yeah. Well, For you to like make that tick in your mind, go okay, well this guy's kind of like a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. Wh- be a lot. What's Mister Big Pockets like? If somebody like who would you? Is there a person that you would be like? This is my number one subscriber. Everybody like can publicly say. Oh yeah, and there's actually some that I I do say that. And then does that make the other guys mad? Do they bring yeah, it up? Because then they want us. But do they bring it up ever? Like who's? No, but who's they'll big they'll John. donate to Chase. No, they'll send more. Like when I go live on TikTok, they'll it will tell you who the top like donator is. They will fight tooth and nail to have that spot. And all I do is like, okay, go up, guys. Thank you, Leaky Cock, for that <laughs> sub. <laughs> like literally, like that Thanks, is. Thanks, Leaky Cock. <laughs> take a bite of pepperoni oh, pizza. Sissy donated more. <laughs> Like, oh, you guys are in a battle. Yeah. Who's the stronger mm. sissy? <laughs> oh, I, thanks, guys. <laughs> can I rant here. about TikTok really quick? Yeah, we do want to know what happened. Okay, so the first, so I started first off on TikTok. I would just, it's so, TikTok is the easiest platform to like blow up on. It's so yeah. beyond easy. It's like disgusting. Like I hit 2,000 followers in a month. Like it was just boom, boom, boom. And all you have to do is like do lip sync video. So I was doing that for a while. And then I was like, you know what? I'm going to go live because I see people get really successful in live. First one, I'm just chilling there, just sitting. And it takes me off and it says you were, um, too boring. Yeah. That too. It was like, you were, uh, banned for promoting gun violence. Why? Did you look at your watching TV? Nothing. She pulled a John Moran and was hanging the gun in the in the No, show. like literally <laughs> nothing. <laughs> <the face> the <laughs> nothing. I was so mad. And so then I just couldn't stream for like two days or something like that. I was like, okay, fine. Then I was streaming like two weeks ago and someone in my chat was just like, spit on me, spit on me, spit on me, spit on me. And I was like, hey, like, let's stop, like chill out, whatever. And then I got taken down. Because and- of the comment. I think so, because it said I was promoting um, sexual activity or something. But I, w- I didn't even, like, say anything. And then it said, you're temporarily banned. And I put in an appeal. And I, like, Google, because I have tried to log in. It's been over 11 days. Nothing. And oh, it says, I know, it says most of the time you get it back within a week. Uh, so I don't think it's coming back, guys. But it still says, like, if I try and log in, it'll be like, you are temporarily banned. Why don't you just re- I, redo it? Because it was so much time and effort. I had to do my makeup, put on a low-cut shirt, be like, uh uh-huh. You don't have them saved or anything like that? Though? I downloaded the data. Isn't that how most of your days start, though? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> With putting on your makeup and yeah. a low-cut shirt? Um, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> but um, it's just so much work. Like, I had so many subs on there. I don't want to have to restart. But if I don't get it, I think I'm going to give it two weeks, 14 days. And if I don't have it back by then, I'm going to restart. 14 days from 11 or 14 days from today? From 11. Okay. You know what else sucks about it, though? I changed my old, my personal TikTok, where I just, like, do, like, stupid shit. Used to be, the username for it used to be the username for my new account, but then I changed it to like a more personal one and then made the new account. So now if you search up the account that was banned, oh, it brings you to that one. It brings you to my personal page. So I have all of these guys like, when are you streaming again? And While my GFE. like little cousins are there and I'm like, fuck. Now it's the GFE. Yeah. You're posting a video of your cousins playing in a park and then all the comments are like, where are the boobs? Where are the boobs? Like, where are the boobs? <laughs> You're like, so I know where bad. that park is. I'm coming right now. I'm coming to that park right now. No, it's so bad. <laughs> and so I don't know what I'm going to but yeah, that's just my rant because I'm really pissed off about TikTok. But I talked to a lot of people and they said like it's 
TikTok's really bad with that. They will just ban you for anything. Like my little cousin, she's like 18. She gets banned every fucking day for being underage. Talk about it, dude. We got banned because we posted a video of some kid smoking a cigarette. Yeah, we can post videos for two weeks because some kid was ripping a dart. That, That's my YouTube fault too. all of a sudden? But now, there's titties on t- full nipple on I, TikTok. No, I was about to say that. I've literally seen women. Full nipple. L- but they're just in the other room. Is that what you're talking about? Yes. Where they're like, have you seen this? No, no. That's because I'm a coon. No, I haven't been looking at that. I would I, never I, I would know. never objectify a woman, dude. I would never look at a woman with lust. But anyway, this woman's in the <laughs> other lust. room. And it's like a silhouette, but she's got yep. she's got cans. So she's you can't actually anger. see them, but it's like no, a shadow. You see I them. love boobs, dude. Is it a shadow? Not as much as me. But this lady oh. this lady's got beach balls, dude. They're hangers. Hangers. And she's just like facing sideways. Like like let's say <laughs> the camera is pointed at me and that's the TikTok camera. Yeah, for sure. You really have this memorized. And huh? she's sideways and she'll walk past the crack in the door. Yep. You see the nip, you see oh. the boob. Everything. But, but it's, it's like, like black. A- because it's like the room is black. But it's for a sec. But it's. But it's, you can see, and they will not get taken down. And a lot of times lot. they'll be wearing like tiny little lingerie that barely covers anything, and the caption will be like, TikTok, it's a swimsuit. And they do not get banned. And then, oh, but when they're walking by, they're like putting on a shirt. So by the time they walk out, they yeah. have a, a tiny little tube top shirt. Yep. That's kind of genius. That, that, that I feel like there's gotta got to be a lot out. of. There's a lot of like thought that has to go into like the timing of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it takes a lot of thought to walk across the door <laughs> with your titties naked. out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. I think she had to study for seven years in well, school to be able to do that. Maybe. Me. <laughs> this guy also went to school for seven years, but he didn't graduate. Yeah, I did. Oh, no. Oh, this guy. Hey, man. Yes, I fucking did. Dude, listen, I graduated with a very <laughs> successful degree, and I've been putting it to work What at a your, restaurant. What are your thoughts on the insurrection? Like, why would you ask that? <laughs> <laughs> like, what kind of fucking question? Well, we knew well, you were there, so, so we were yeah, like, I, I saw yeah, you there. So right. I saw you throwing Molotovs into the police crowd. <laughs> Honestly, I'm one mental breakdown away from that. So from going to the Capitol building and t- tearing it up. No, honestly, though, I would more likely be like in the like everything's chaos behind me, and it's just me like handing out like OnlyFans like uh, QR codes. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, here. Go home. I Squeeze actually, your hog. Okay, wait. I want your guys' opinion on something. Yeah, okay. okay. I keep seeing an empty billboard. That <laughs> Shoot, <yes. laughs> That would be the correct. Right? Yes. Okay. I would. Yes, yes. Yes. Okay, so I keep seeing this empty billboard on my way to the gym. And I'm like, so what if it was just like a photo of me? Like, And it's like, my only fans are They're expensive. And I think you do oh. have to pass certain regulations. <laughs> they're expensive. Like, I don't, can't afford it. I think they're like two grand a month. That's nothing, you fucking idiot. It's actually... Do you... That's <laughs> fucking embarrassing for you to say. You think that's a lot of money, dude? You think my you know can't... you know who's sitting in this chair over You here, think dude? my army can't take care of that for me? Dude, you are talking sideways at her this entire fucking time, I know. dude. This is insanity. But you and know you, what? Hey, you pret- should get on your hands and knees and apologize and beg that she doesn't walk out of here this instant. Hey, hey pretend boyfriend, will you pay for this billboard <laughs> this so that billboard. all these other guys can see me on they this... They would. They would. You know what a lot of them say? I know, I know you're gonna get big. I know you're gonna blow up. Just please don't forget me. I want you to get huge. I want you to get ginormous. You're gonna get to like 400 pounds. It's gonna be huge. You know what's fucking annoying? I was one of the. I, I'm not just being like, I was the best. This is what he loves to do too. I started OnlyFans before, like no Twitch girls had it. Nothing. Just like you. I no, legit. And I had (laughs) so many. I was in the top point one percent for a very long time. It's the worst injury the doctors ever seen. You and him, <laughs> you and him love being the the pioneers, the trends. But I was. So, oh no, I believe you, dude. If the doctor. And then I stopped, it. and now I'm pissed because now it's so much harder because it's such like a, dude, um, I know. like there's it's, it's saturated. Now everybody's so breaking saturated. their ribs, and I was the first one. Yeah, he humped a guy so good it broke his rib, and it was the worst break the doctors ever ever. Seen. That's a, that's a the worst cool way to get injured for sure. And I was the first. He was the first one to go into that house, but don't get a uh, rib broken, actually. That's Ever. crazy. It, it was, the doctor said this. It was in the top 0.1% of rib cra- uh, fractures. Before Harry For a really long time. <laughs> I don't care. But, yeah, the you know, you could do the <laughs> billboard, and it might work. Yeah. That would be hilarious. I do think that there are, like, on a, I do think there are legal things, like, that you would have to pass. I think I'd have to... I don't think I could blatantly say it's for OnlyFans. I don't even think you could be dressed crazy. Like, I've seen ones where it's like, you know, uh, 
a, a, a strip club billboard, yeah. but it's this still pretty like. You know what? You could do a silhouette. You know what billboards fucking go crazy? I don't know. The real estate women. Full. Oh yeah, full there's tits. one. Oh yeah. I've you seen. wanna you wanna look at homes with Amy? I'm like what? No, I yeah, you're right. Uh, no, there's one that I have to drive home past all I the time. I guarantee it's the same one. With I'm the picking. green shirt lady. Yes. Yeah, she's the fucking that. big ass tits. And it's literally like some... you want to get more with her or something yeah. like that. Like yeah. she's kind of implying. Yeah. Yes, and I look at it every time Dude, and I'm like, I, think I, I do, I do. That's so funny. maybe that's what I would do. Mm. I do sell houses. That would be awesome. That would be so you, sick if you did that. No. It's like get more with Amy. Or like, yeah. It, like you, your, fill me your up. realtor will give you more. And Just it's like yeah. big letters. Fill me up. <laughs> yeah. With your money for this house. Yeah. Would oh, you, you agree that like the only thing women want is to feel full? Full of what? Just like, wait, you know. Fulfilled like, or full no, no, of cock? No, 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 no. Just like, you know, just like the main thing women want is to feel... <laughs> I love the generalization full, of women. Full. But just to feel full. 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 <laughs> I'm never full. That's what we <laughs> thought you might say. <laughs> okay. I Trust just us, love we the could tell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just love the generalization. All women. Well, they just want to feel. Is this like how I hate all men? Full. Oh. Would you agree with that or no? No. Okay. But are you prepared so to go funny. another 20 years with no pussy? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. These questions were for somebody else. <laughs> oh, so you just reuse, recycle for but me. But it's another schizophrenic, so it might yeah. be ap- applicable. Do you, honestly, though, girls, I can, I love women, but I, and a man, I can flirt, I can do whatever. A girl comes, I'm like, <laughs> like, I can't do it. I, I, I get too nervous. You, they make, you, you make them call you sissy. I would. You call me a sister. I would. I would. All right, here. You you pretend to be a woman, and then I'll be her. Trying oh. to flare with a woman. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> so I can't act out myself. Got no. it. No, no, no. No, no, uh, Hey, what's going on? Oh, you look like shit. Oh, that's, oh, that's kind of weird. I, I just, we just met, so I was like, I don't know. God, I can tell you spend so much time on your makeup and just looks like shit. Oh, thank Oh, well. You're you just talking about the way he's been talking you, to me. You don't know. <laughs> you, this whole time. I just... I, wait, I think I know you. Didn't we just, didn't we like know each other way back when? Maybe, I don't know. I it's kind of hard to tell with so much more fat on your face I mean, and a lot around of people, your neck. Oh, and what I, the hell is going like, on Like, you right just now? look like shit. You're... No, 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 you're getting it all wrong. The way men treat me, where they're like, step on me, I'll I'll get on my hands and knees. That's how I am with women. Oh. I can't, like, I can't handle it. I can't. Why? I'm in love with them. Yeah, you're in love with women. Yeah, I'm in love with Well, what would you do if you were with James Charles? Would you fuck James Charles? I want to punch that kid in the face. I want to put him in a storage container and just let him rot. That is the worst take you've had since you got on this podcast. I'm not. Are you lie. serious? We. Your stance. We. I've always said that if uh, thinking James Charles is cute is gay, then I'm the biggest gay bow on this earth. You're like it's a meme though, right? I think it, it's time to wrap this whole thing. <laughs> yeah, actually, this is going really well, but if you could leave. No, I really, I'm a James Charles hater. A lot of girls feel that way, and I wonder if it's because he's more beautiful than all women. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I think so. I think just his beauty is kind of like. Or like the clips of him trying to sing that are like horrendous. That well, we don't like, watch that. We just watch the booty bop. We just watch out. the wig videos. And The, the one of him videos. in like that, in the fucking like snow with that like leopard print outfit on oh, yeah, where it's just his favorite. BBL. Yeah. My favorite's when he's wearing a pink bikini out by the pool. So you also like that he messages like 13-year-old boys. Yeah, I pretend to be underage for him. Oh, that makes messages. sense. It's the only way you're going to talk to him. He's just trying to poop. I'm like, hey, James He's Charles. just trying to poop. <laughs> he's just trying to poop. <laughs> Good callback. That is so funny. Just James Charles is a <laughs> meth addict pedophile. I'm <laughs> just trying to poop. That's also, though, like as a fellow constipated queen, I feel for that guy. That's because you eat too much fast food from your pay pigs. Okay. It's because you're getting so fucking fat. (laughs) You're just putting so much in, it can't possibly get out in time. (laughs) Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Very funny stuff. Very good. funny stuff here. You think when you leave this, it's going to kind of reset your whole mentality on the idea of doing vor content? Do you think maybe? Yeah. Or, like, just sissifying people? Like, when you... Because what we've been trying to do on this whole thing, on our whole show, is, like, we've kind of had an underlying tone of, like, you know, sissy hypnos. How many times have you driven drunk in the last three months? Not 
never. Okay, but how many times have you driven drunk in the last three months? <laughs> never. <laughs> I genuinely have never. Hi. Every day. The other day, I was no, one I'm time get canceled. I'll tell you one. One time I was driving around so baked out of my mind. I drove in a cer- it I was driving around kind of not my Doesn't neighborhood. Doesn't it feel like Mario Kart when you're high? No. Oh. But I was driving around million retweets. Five billion <laughs> trillion million <laughs> retweets up. and likes. But I was driving around like multiple neighborhoods just because I didn't want to go home yet because I was like freaking red eyed, mm-hmm. blah, blah, blah. And then I was like, wait, isn't there supposed to be a building at this corner? I'm like, I live here my whole life. No, there's definitely a building at the. And then I'm like, well, I'll just, dr- I'll just drive around again and I'll catch it. I did this triangle literally like seven times looking for the building. And I was so baked, I was like getting really scared. I'm like, I d- that was really funny. Different I thought dimension. I, I really thought I lived here. I thought I was, <laughs> I, I was like literally on the verge of tears. And then on the eighth time around, I saw that it was just in a different yeah. corner. And then I finally found it. No, the other day I was driving high and what? Dude, have you seen the signs? Right? Yeah. I mean, you've seen yeah, the puff puff past the joint <laughs> to someone else if you're driving. So based. Um, I was driving 25 and a 55. <laughs> That's crazy. When I'm high, it's like I'm going so... Because I'm a really fast driver. And when I'm high, I drive so slow, which is probably a good thing. But then people were like honking at me. I'm like, what the fuck? What's going on? And then I realized, oh, yeah, it's fine. I'm asleep at the wheel. Yeah, my mind is so fragile that when I am under any sort of uh, substance... Like, w- we took uh, mushrooms one time as a group. Oh, I and I was in Arizona, and they have a McDonald's. They have a McDonald's in Arizona where the sign is blue rather than yellow. And, like, I was already on them when we saw the sign. And when I saw that the McDonald's sign was blue, I thought that we were transported to a different dimension. That makes sense. And I got really, really scared that we were going to be you stuck there. You probably were. There. And then I, I, I kept saying something like, I, I, like I was talking about, like, my mom, like, she's not going to, she's I'm not going to be my mom when I go back there. I don't want to talk to my blue mom. I don't want to talk to things is like Rick and that. Morty. Honestly, on the way here, I was listening to a UFO podcast. So I like that. Like, maybe you did. Maybe shrooms opened your mind and you went into a different dimension. Yeah, it was, I met my blue My mind. friend had a um, UFO experience on shrooms. Okay. Oh, yeah. Looked into the sky and saw a UFO. And I was in the other room listening to music, crying on my floor. I love doing that on shrooms, listening to an album and just crying. Dude, can you talk, do you want to talk about, ba- like, how basic I am? This is me on shrooms, sitting on my floor, listening to Pink Floyd, crying. It's a masterpiece. You're so right. You're so, oh my God. Like, come on. Dude, the money sound. Oh! <laughs> oh! I yes. did that on uh, 2CP. I still have shrimps. <laughs> yeah, I was listening to <laughs> Sabbath and then Pink Floyd. Beautiful. Beautiful combo. Bing, ba, bing, no, that's a different one. Sorry. Do you believe in ghosts? I do. I've had a lot of ghost experiences. Oh, that's a surprise. And how, how many of them have paid <laughs> you? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the crazy bitch has had ghost experiences. Oh, what a surprise. Let me guess. You've heard some voices, too. I also was like one of those kids that loved attention and convinced like a bunch of people that- That's a shock, too. Yeah, uh, I know, right? And convinced like everyone I knew that I was possessed. <laughs> okay, that's insane. That is funny. <laughs> Literally, all, like the, a, like, all the time. I would pretend to be sleepwalking, and I'd be like, I'm going to grab a knife. And all my friends, nobody had sleepovers with me anymore. Did but anybody even believe you? Or oh, were yeah. Just like, this chick's weird. Yeah. My sister, well, this one was kind of, my sister, like, to this day is like, oh, my God, Julie was so scary. Like, she was haunted. And I was like, oh, I mean, yeah, it was just. It was called method act. Yeah, I was like, actually, I'm an actress. <laughs> yeah, I used to like wait. I would pretend to be sleeping for a while, and then I'd open my eyes and I'd start like saying the alphabet backwards and shit. And she'd be like, <gasps> "Yeah, why would you do that she for attention?" Start, it was fun. She I just start saying slurs backwards, <laughs> so nobody would know. Surgeon cuff, surgeon cuff, surgeon I felt like a fucking genius coming up with that. That was so funny. That was hilarious. It's cold in here. That's yeah, why I got I'm a jacket. And I'm feeling hot. Okay. Well, maybe you're possessed. Is it because you're on perks? I'm out the perk. I wish I was itching and scratching I'm and tweaking. Itching, man. I can't even go a minute without the perk on the molly, man. I can't believe you would do that. You would be pretend to be possessed. That is insane. You really can't believe that. Anymore. I mean, I can believe yeah. it. I can definitely believe it. Wait, I can definitely. And you girl think- posts on OnlyFans for attention, and you can't believe that. So, do you, you actually think ghosts are real, though? You're going to be one of those people when you're older that you just stay in a hospital 24-7. Yeah, probably. Pretending that something's wrong with you. You know they released Mur- me from the hospital. Like, you know they released me in the hospital for 
after Faking three it? days because they said I wasn't depressed enough. <laughs> well, I was like, the they need to make space. They were like, oh. you should uh, try to you should try to prove a point in the hospital. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, I'm not depressed enough. Check this out. <laughs> Watch out this. The window. <laughs> just, just backwards out the window. And also at that same hospital, they let me. The other girls wouldn't eat all of their food. <laughs> <laughs> and they were like, yeah, Julia, you can eat it. So I'd eat like 17 ice creams a night. And they were like, yeah, she's fine. Release her. So all these <laughs> chicks are anorexic. Yeah. And, they're, and, they're and I'm like, don't worry, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Bertha. <laughs> they, 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 said, they said you were all good. It turns the out you The feeders are right. <laughs> turns, we've, got, we've got this NFL linebacker here. <laughs> Have you seen her feet? Size ten. It turns out <laughs> they were you. You weren't better. They just needed to save money on their food. They were just like, like she's eating us out. She's fine. We're literally down. We're gonna three have grand. to. We're gonna have to perform fifteen <laughs> brain tumor surgeries a day to keep up with this. Ice we cream do not experience. have the government budget for this. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. I think hospitals uh, are privately owned, but that was good. Some um, of them are privately owned for sure. I think you know most what? Of them are. Me just telling stories like that because I do this often. Like whenever I meet a new person, we'll have like a trauma dump together, and because that's like how I bond. And you do that at the grocery store and stuff. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> so I have this thing where I love egging hey. crazy people on. Yeah. Love it. I'm, like, friends with, like, 18 old ladies who are, like, so, like, I this one old lady <laughs> that I dog sit for, she, like, will smoke on her porch, and she's, like, well, you heard about Bigfoot, right? And I'm, like, totally. He slays. <laughs> and she's, like. She's, like, you know, I slept with Bigfoot. <laughs> Literally. I love it. I love it. I fucking love that shit. Wasn't as big as I thought it would be. It <laughs> nope. didn't quite make me feel <laughs> <Say> no. full. <laughs> the reason they call him Big. Would not be <laughs> good one. That is a certified good one. <laughs> um, hey, that's pretty good. Yeah, no. What I don't even remember what I was saying, but yeah, I'm crazy. I you like were saying it. you love to egg crazy people. I on. love it, and <laughs> oh, and trauma dump, and then but then what happens is after the trauma dump or after something like this, I go sit in my car and I'm gonna sit there and be like, God, I'm fucked up. There's some I. Wesson was right about everything he said about me before I showed up. Okay, but can we just say that you could literally flame me to my face, yeah, yeah. as you have, and I could care less. You're king of the good times. If you were a girl doing it, it would shatter me. That's kind of weird. She'd probably scream at us. I have no women. respect for men, so. Yeah, but like, you know. <laughs> I thought she was going to say women. I know. That, <laughs> no. That's just with, with, you know, we're up here and you're <laughs> over there. Yeah. You have a lot in common with with Big Dan, dude. Stop. <laughs> yeah, Honestly, give true. Big Dan my number. No, okay. he he will probably. Well, actually, he's out of money now. He's yeah, not he's getting, out of money. He he's was like, getting money from the government because his dad's retarded after the war. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> his, his dad drools on himself twenty four seven. So dad's that missing half of his head. I'm. S- <laughs> <laughs> I saw a bumper sticker. <laughs> he's just like, he's like, just like grasping for shit. Stinky diaper, Mikey. He's got like ten percent grip strength. <laughs> he's one hundred and eighty percent disabled. <laughs> oh my fucking god! Yeah, I see some of those. So, oh. what kind of level of consciousness do you attribute to animals? Oh, this is a good question for her. Oh, a lot, like hi- high. What do you con- above humans? Or? If you met my cats, <laughs> you <laughs> this is about to get ten million likes. Dude. <laughs> if you met my cats, I'm oh. so fucking nuts. I'm insane. You would be like, oh, they know what they're doing. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even fucking take you seriously. <laughs> if you met my cats, <laughs> you wouldn't. You wouldn't. Uh, no, I get what you're saying. I, he's a goofy boy or whatever, but <laughs> he's a silly kid. No, my girl cat is like genuinely like a human. I walked in one time and she was writing a novel. <laughs> well, what, okay, I ordered her a birthday cake that has devil horns on it. Is it like cat related? Yep. Isn't it so? Can insane? the cat eat it? Yeah. Or can you only eat it? <laughs> I'm gonna eat it with her. We're gonna split it. You're gonna it's go. a little cattuccino. <laughs> She's like, look, I got you a fucking cake. <laughs> no, it's made by like a lady who makes cat cake. She's just pounded the cake in front of this cat. Go to your bed. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna cut like, you're gonna cut like a little triangle. My cat and opens then pick doors. Up the big piece. <laughs> She's conscious. Consciousness. 
Sounds like well, she's question- trapping her. What level of consciousness do oh, you like attribute? T- well, then there's some really fucking stupid dogs. Dogs are Golden kind of doodles, dumb. I want to punt them across the fucking there, room. There's some dogs. Like, I have a bulldog, and he looks uh, at he just looks at me as if he's not there. Every bulldog I've met just licks their cock all day. <laughs> yeah, he that's what he does. Yes! What is up with that? He's got some hangers down there, I too. I know. What man. is up with that? He's a big, bald dog. Big, bald dog. And uh, My nephew that was just bald. <laughs> I... She sent me the baby pictures. I said, I'm sorry, what the fuck is that? Huge. Huge dick? No, balls. Oh. What? Huge balls. I don't think that's right. Like <laughs> well. Like <a> don't, bad <laughs> dragon. <laughs> don't, don't babies not have balls? I'm talking like. I thought babies didn't have ball- I thought they balls. I they fell out. I think well, ba- balls. I'm sorry. Develop when you're like can 17. You repeat, can you repeat that? Your balls You thought out. babies' balls fell out? Yeah. What is that? What does that mean? They're up here, and then they go down there. They're, like, up in the gooch. And then that's why they call it your balls dropping. They drop further. No. Is that true? I believe Not me. Dude. I don't know anything about babies. My balls did. <laughs> I've never looked at a baby's genitals for one. Yeah, so like I can't. I didn't do it on purpose. I, I can't. I can't well, speak to this. Sounds like you have some saved on your phone. <laughs> Ma'am, we're going to have to call the police. I'm just trying to shit. <laughs> shit. Sorry, I can't stop saying it. <laughs> it's pretty funny, the idea of somebody just in a store like, I got a shit. I also really wonder how he got there, because he clearly could not drive a car. Well, he can when somebody's not about to catch him for being a pedophile. Or do you think he smoked the meth in the parking lot before he walked in? So that's a hard no on James Charleston? Yeah. Like, I would love to torture him. Well, in a follow-up, why are your standards so high? <laughs> I mean, look at me. But James Charles. Like, they're higher than James I Charles? I like, cut his toes off one by one. Why? I don't know. He makes me irrationally angry. Beautiful man. He's just too pretty. Maybe. <coughs> Would you pay for, like, James Charles to call you sissy? No. Would you call James Charles a sissy if he paid you? Yeah. If James Charles is not a sissy. I'd call anyone anything if they pay me. Anything? What a, yeah, anything. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay you $5 to call me a very specific word right now. Okay. No. Off camera? No. No, on camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It, it. Uh, no, you These were. are tickling me. So, uh, how many times have you said the N-word in the last three months? Um, zero, most likely, but. Come on. Not, not, in, like, not in a mad way. Like just singing like, a song. I'm sorry, but it really bothers. Like, that's how I know you peaked in high school and have never grown up, is if you still say the N-word. But what if you say but it, it, like, it all was, the time? But it was cool in high school. It was cool in high school. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy for you guys. All you right. That. Going right past Oh, no, though. you said it. You said it. We, no. We're just agreeing with you. No. Well, you did say it before okay. we started rolling the cameras. You called us. You're like, hey, what up, you? I'm never going to have a career after this thing. What oh. up, you friggin'? <sighs> nope. Here's what a good son qu- of a. I've got one right here. I've got one. Okay. How much are you going to invest into the Bunky Boys? I hope you say a lot. Well... Maybe after this, maybe. I'll give you guys like a, you know what, Olive Garden gift card. Olive yes. Garden gift. This guy likes. Olive I know. Garden. I've heard. I love Olive Garden. But he doesn't like the well, people not the so one much he, though. No, not the Gurney. You gotta go to the Vern. Oh, that's yeah, whatever. Oh, oh no, guys. Oh, you gotta go to the. the uh, I made an oopsie. You gotta go to the. Uh, the one, one where they don't the hire mentally disabled people. Yeah, like half the people from our high school. All right. All the people. Yep, including us. Especially me. Well, this one is a question that's quite obvious, but I'll ask it anyways. Are you autistic? Yeah. No, I genuinely believe I am. You don't have it, like, on paper or anything, though? My doctor... What it? Doctor? Sorry. My doctor wants, yes. <laughs> wants to give me My test. doctor gave me the money. <laughs> my doctor told me it's so bad. I said, I welcome to my doctor. I said, I'll give you said, Let me get a bacon, egg, and cheese. 500 billion rupees to come and talk. I'll fly you. <laughs> so what did your doctor tell you? My doctor told me to get tested, but I don't want to be put on medication. For autism, for autism. <laughs> for, okay. Like ADHD and all that stuff, but I don't want to have an ADHD at that point. Come on, like basically autism. Um, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but I don't want to be medicated, so what's the point of going through the I testing? Agree. Fuck getting medicated. Yeah. I think most people in our generation and the, the one below us are autistic. It's the Everyone? next evolution, dog. Dude, hell yeah. Dude, I, the TikTok generation below us, they're well, we're technically Gen Z. I know, but... We're the very upper cutoff. I'm old, though, guys. I'm older than you, I bet. 
I turned 25 this year. I turned 25 this year. You do? Yeah. Oh, so you're old too. Okay. This guy's uh, this guy's almost a full year behind me. Dude, so he just what was your turned. birthday? Um, me? No. Me? Yes. October. No, I'm looking right at you. It's hard to tell. Oh, oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> Jeez, Louise. I'm about He's a fucking idiot women. Um, <laughs> she's I'm glad she she's said it. Googly eyed. I can't fucking tell. <laughs> she's got I'm not even wearing eyes. glasses. <laughs> yeah. She's blinking hor- uh, vertically. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That makes sense. But I'm. We're old. What is the definition of love? Um, I think it depends. Do you want an honest answer? Yes. Yeah. I don't know, man. I, that, I can't answer that, guys. I've run out of funny memes, jokes, no, everything. I'm blank. This one. I'm blank. I don't know. Love is like good sex. That's all I can think of. Wow, that's pretty <laughs> fucking bad. <laughs> What a surprise. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> All right. Here's a good question. This is yeah, a skip over that. This. this is for, I'm going to read this you as this. I'm going to read this question to you, but it's not going to make any sense directed towards you, but okay. I want you to still answer it. Okay. Is it true that you were blocked by a girl on OnlyFans because you creeped her out in the DMs? Like she literally won't let you pay her to talk to you. She should have an unblock fee. Most of us do. $50 to unblock usually. 50 bucks. What would get somebody blocked? Like just being mean or something? Overly mean. A little mean's okay. Annoying. If you're messaging me constantly, constantly, and then you're getting mad because I'm not messaging back, fuck off. I don't want to deal with you. And then you can pay the fifty dollars to then have me unblock you. Um Swag. Yeah. Mostly just like being mean and stuff like that. But no, I was not blocked. But I probably was the girl that blocked him. You wishes. No, you weren't the girl that blocked him. I know he's he you and him have no overlap, which is what makes this so insane. Do you want to know a fun fact? What? A lot of people from our high school sub to my OnlyFans and are idiots because they use their real names. How would, many is I'm a not, lot? I'm not shocked by that at all. I would assume a maybe lot. I would assume that maybe over half. No. A lot. Not half. There was a weird thing in high school where <laughs> every guy if they saw me in the hallways, they had no clue who I was. But then, like, outside of school, was like, oh, you're so hot. And I'm like, guys, am I that embarrassing? <laughs> Maybe. I think, I think you just They're answered like, it. no, we can't. Yeah, no, there's a lot from high school that are, that I've, I've blocked some, It's a big percentage. Too. Yeah, right? it's, yeah. So how many people do you have blocked, like, right now from this stuff? Um, Honestly, not that many. Because most of my people are pretty respectful. And a lot of times... If I tell them I don't like the way they're acting, they just are pussies and p- pussies. I said that weird, and get embarrassed and just like unsub. What well, do any of them ever just say I'm sorry and then like you guys continue your conversation? You know what I get the I'm sorry for a lot. Being too horny and sending you stuff that you didn't want. Sending me like 75 page novels about how amazing I am, then being like I'm sorry. I know that was a little much. That's the only time they really apologize. That's so funny to me. These guys literally don't even know you, but they're writing five-page novels about oh, how amazing can I, you are. Oh, can I? I really want to read you guys one. Oh, it's I would so please, funny. please. I would love that. The more DMs that you leak, okay. the better. Dude, Hold do you on. know? Okay, while you're pulling that up, it, it, are there people that are just like? Uh, I can't see shit. In like this. they'll be like they'll give you a bad excuse as to why they've sent you anything. Like, oh man, that wasn't even me. I do get. Um, <laughs> my friggin' brother started squeezing his hog over my yeah, computer. A lot of people will be like, "I'm sorry, I got drunk last night. I didn't mean to send that." And I'm like, "Okay, yeah, sure." Um. Oh, we forgot to ask her the base questions. What? <laughs> what month is it? I was re- guys. The only question I was prepared for was there was one question you asked on a different one that, and it was the only. One I was prepared for. Which was what? Um, what's the most sexual animal or something like that? Oh, yeah. What's your spirit animal? No, it was like, what animal are you most sexually attracted to? You guys asked to someone else. And oh, I had yeah. I had that. It's a big Dan. I, yeah. Oh, I had that prepared. That was my only question I had Well, prepared. now we can't ask that. We, oh, okay. Why do you think she'll say sea hotter? No, because she has it prepared. Oh, we so want to we have to just answer. waste her time as much as possible. Right, true. Okay. Um, it's not a specific Lion King from Lion King 2. Interesting. A specific lion I meant from Lion King oh, 2. Oh, that's a cartoon. That ad, that falls into what cartoon porn did you watch when you first started watching porn? Which, well, you could answer that question. What cartoon porn did you watch? Um, 
I'm not that into cartoon porn. It's a little weird for me. No, but, but when but you're, you're like, like 13. No, we all grew out of it. Yeah. yeah. But, like, what was your taste? Like, what did you... Family mm, Guy. Foster's no, Home. No. Simpsons. I'm trying to think. Family Guy. Family Guy? No. I didn't watch... I've never seen The Simpsons. Symptoms. Well, in tandem with that, what are your thoughts on abortion? Girl... If I found out I was pregnant right now, get the coat hanger. You'd, it's you'd time. Human centipede, push it out. Oh my god, fuck that shit. You'd have somebody like close a car door. Fuck on you. that shit. Sorry, I'm trying to find. But a back good, to the cartoon porn. I'm trying to find a good DM to read you. Yeah, well, the, there's probably so many, which is yeah. what makes it so fun. I want to find one that like. Um. Have you ever gone on a date from with any of these people? Did you? That pay no 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 not like the sissy I mean like somebody that's paying you. No. I'm pretty sure she candidly said I'm online only and I will never well, meet with anybody. It depends on like. There are people I that see. we know that have sent me money that in the past yeah. But that's different. It's that's not like. Different. Not somebody who started as online and then went into in person that hasn't happened. But somebody who started in person. Then went online and then went back to in person is completely different. Right, 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 right. <laughs> the, oh my god, the usernames on these are so good. I would love to hear the usernames. Don't go too far back. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on, hold What on. are your thoughts on the Islamic faith? Okay. Ishallah, brother. Ishallah. Okay, that's all. Yeah, no comment. No comment. <gasps> Guys. What? Mm. One of my loyal people on oh, yeah. What? He was going through a really rough time, though, so. Why? And you weren't calling him. Oh, his wife. Enough? His wife was cheating on him with the neighbor, and he found out. And I'm like, but you were basically cheating on her with me, so. I mean, I'm not reciprocating, but you're still, like, paying to see women online, so. And that would suck if one of your, your significant other was, like, looking at other people online, right? Why do you ask that? I'm just saying. I'm do you know about something? Because <laughs> no. it does really suck. <laughs> well, okay. now you know how this guy's wife felt. That's why he cheated on her. Or she cheated on him. Yeah, I do have like a very... <laughs> it's a very complex feeling. Wow, that feeling. really struck a chord. Yeah, it did. <laughs> I, I have a very complex feeling because I am very against that. Like even just... Cheating you, on your husband? Uh, yeah, but also like if... My significant other was looking at even like girls in bikinis that bothers me. But then I'm like, I'm that girl for a lot of, for hundreds of millions of people. Uh, at this point, <laughs> yeah, damn for, in the, for all. So of then India. it's like a weird, it's a weird feeling because then I start to feel like shit. But then I remember I don't care. So that's not my problem; it's their problem for being unfaithful. Um. Okay, I'm trying to find a good DM for you guys. Hold on. Can you at least read some of the the usernames? We're waiting very patiently. Dangling Wang. Funny. Um. You really can't see my phone, right? No. Okay, cool. No. But if you if you went like this to just show us the amount of DMs, that would be funny. Yeah, but then you would see my spread asshole, so. Uh oh. Oh. Yeah, I can't. I remember. thought it was like a list of the names of the people, kind of like an iMessage. It would show all the numbers or the contact names. <laughs> uh, like, not, not in the chat, throughout all the different chats, you know what I'm saying? Hold on, I'm trying. I can't do two things at once. What does your diet consist of? Have you ever cooked a meal for Cock. yourself? If so, what do you cook? Cock. You, how do you cook it? Uh. <coughs> Have you ever cooked Sorry. a meal for yourself? Like that? <laughs> I just cough on it. <laughs> um, I do cook. I like to cook. You've cooked before? Yeah. Oh. I use cum in most recipes. Gross. And piss. And blood. And shit. Farts. Farts. Blood. Yeah. Blood. Ew. I drink the crumb. That one actually freaks me out. I eat Eating blood? Yeah. You never yeah, eat your own blood? Yeah, it kind of freaks me out too. I mean, I have my own blood. It seems Why is it so different to eat another person's blood? You're not into blood play? My <laughs> own. <laughs> Dude, you, what if a girl said, I want to bleed on you? Uh, that would be What bad. if? Okay, wait, 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 wait. I know someone who was dating a girl, and in the middle of sex, she literally looked at him and was like, punch me in the face as hard as you can. Yeah. What would you guys do? Would you be into it, or would you be like, fuck? I would say, no. are you sure? I would say, yeah, I would say what? If a woman <gasps> asked me to do anything during sex, I'm going to go, are you I sure? I just remembered a really good... Um, Tinder story that you're gonna love. Is it about and being him? sissy hypnotized? It, it happens. There's. It's about sissy. A reference to CS:GO. Oh, I love CS:GO. CS:GO too, by the way. Just. Oh, announced. dude, I'm so pumped. Would you like to hear the story? Yeah, but are you gonna still show us one of those things? Yeah, but it's taking me a while to find okay. it, so give me a second. And I'm not scrolling now, so I guess it's gonna take me even longer. But whatever. Um, I was 
talking to this guy for a while who <laughs> was the manager for a CSGO team. Which team? Yeah, what CSGO I team? I will not comment on that. You don't know the mm. answer. There's I no don't, actually, yeah. but he was, like, I... Yes. North, like, like a real CSGO team or like a semi-pro? Semi-pro, probably. Okay. So we don't know. But still. Well, I might know. Still. It's a funny story, guys. Okay. So I went over to his house that the whole team was living in. And he's like, oh, yeah. Stinky. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's like, oh, come on in. Come on in. I walk in. Instantly, like seven PC setups. They're in the middle of pl- like a tournament. And he's like, yeah, I'm just going to. Guys, I'll be back 20 minutes. I'm like, this Oh, sick. Awesome. So went into his basement. He did slap me in the face um, and like missed my face and hit my ear. So I couldn't hear for a while. So that was like really not fun. But anyways, past that. Um, like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> You're hitting dogs? Not me, but some people. Oh, okay. Some people would do that. You. Some people would do terrible League things players. to dogs. League players. Um, but then we went back like upstairs shit. after everything happened. My hair's a mess. Like my shirt's like, I'm like crumpled. And they moved my shoes, so I had to walk. And all of these guys are streaming because they're playing, and it's like a tournament, and there's like whatever. And in the background, you can see me hobble past, like hair a mess, like clothes strew, like grind my shoes. And I like look into the camera when them. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Sorry. And then there's a clip of that, and you would like it. That is crazy. It's a good story. I wish it was C9. They lived in a gamer house, but yeah, then. Cra- could you imagine? She's like right behind Freakazoid. <laughs> I would love that. Like, what if it was Freakazoid? He's playing like Dust 2. Uh, the hell? <laughs> What's a 15 year old doing in the gamer <laughs> Shut house? Shut up! What the hell? Okay, wait. I'm going to find a DM while you talk to me. Yeah, sure. So, like. Oh, here's one. Oh, perfect. Honestly, <laughs> your smile lights up the entire world. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's what they say to me. And what it's a like. Shakespeare. Mm hmm. Yeah. And you just roll your eyes and go, whatever, pay pig, send me cash. Oh, this guy said, my elbow gave out, so I'll probably need surgery. <laughs> That's what they tell me. My elbow gave out. His elbow gave out. And then they say you why? hilarious oh, uh, God. Facebook memes of gifts of <gasps> Santa. I just thought. I... His elbow gave out? That's insane. That yeah. is like an absolutely absurd thing. Oh, to he say. was cranking his hog <laughs> yeah. nonstop and he pulled his elbow. Well, yeah, that's. <laughs> Did you lose it? What? Did you lose it? Are you are you spacing out? What's happening? Yeah, I'm scrolling through <laughs> and I like lost. I, I scrolled all the way back down to the bottom. Dude, you're lost in the Twitterverse. Yeah, I think my Instagram DMs are better. Oh yeah, you get a lot of. Oh my fucking god, it's kind of, kind kind of insane. Why are there so many? I don't know. Like, why are there so many long ones? I know. Isn't it weird that they would message me? Yeah, like that, that, this is so bizarre. <laughs> okay. I can't phantom that. <laughs> no, it makes no sense. How many people have pestered you for like months and months on end with no response? Oh, man. No response. Many. You know what's funny? So I send out scheduled posts and <laughs> not even with like photos. I'll send out like scheduled DMs that are just like, how's your day going? Because it makes them feel like you're talking to them. Or I'll be like, morning sex or nighttime sex <laughs> which one like just stupid shit and they fully think you're only talking to them scheduled like as in you scheduled on a clock or it does the app does it for you so i can go onto a calendar and say i want this to post at 10 a.m i want this dm to go out at 11 p.m i want and, and it, so i'll do like two weeks worth and you can do the dm to specific people and say yep. the usernames and make it so it's separate yep Whoa, this app is literally like manipulation yeah. software. That's but insane. I know, but I just do mass, like I'll do a mass messages. Yeah. Or like if I already know I sent content to someone, but I want to make money off someone else, I'll send it to like the new people only. That's insane. Yeah. Like the fact, no, it's not insane that you do that. It's insane that that app allows you to do that on such an intricate level. I could schedule posts for two months. You're blowing his mind so much right now because he's like, I thought they were all talking to me. (laughs) I thought they all really like me. Wait, you're telling me they don't care if I like morning sex? It's just genius. That's just like a genius uh, app thing. Not for you to do it. That's like everybody's doing it. That's badass. I'm, my hands or icicles right now. Are you going It's to so freezing story? down here. This guy keeps it like an igloo. I just want to hear one one poem, one thing from one of these geniuses. That her smile bl- Hold bright, on. her smile brightens the whole world. That's oh, I have a good one if I can find the screenshot. One second. A line. I have a like a guy that sent me $500. He sent me like 
a funny script. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me find it. When would that be? He sends you 500 bucks and he said, you should see how much I send the other girls. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's a great question too, actually, is all yeah. these dudes, they're sending you money. How many other, like... Oh, I'm sure a lot. Mommies do you think they can have? But how many can you really afford? Well, when you're not broke, you can afford a lot. <laughs> dude, you think the guy whose wife cheated on him with the neighbor should have been spending more time with her? That probably didn't even happen, dude. He's probably just, yeah, trying, he's probably to just get, trying to get sympathy. Exactly. He's just trying to get her to be like, Oh, that sucks. You know, I'm, so I'm sorry, always here honey. for you. you know, I'm here for you. Oh, my God. You. I threw up in my mouth. You know, I'm here for you. Spit it out. I did, though. Like, I actually threw up in my mouth a little bit. Could you spit it out first? Yeah, sorry. Next time. Maybe undo those feet. (laughs) (laughs) What? (laughs) Stop. I don't know. I was just spitballing. Could you look really pissed off while you do it, too? (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my God. That's the guy that asked me for my feet. He's like, I want you to flip me off and look pissed off. What is that? What? No nudity. Just pissed off. Just mad. I need my giantess to be mad at me. I need, eat can you me. eat me? What did you just say? Giantess. Giantess. Like Vor? Like the giantess. I thought you were just calling me fat again. <laughs> well, n- Vor. Uh, it's well, Vor I was, but also Vor. We got a few more of those before we're done. Thanks. Like giantess. Oh, I'm trying to find... And this is... Guys, this is really difficult. I just have to, so many to go through. She's, she's, like, she's like, I can't expose him. She, he just sent me a grand. Oh, this one just sent me 750. Uh. No, I don't care if I expose them. What if you get like a little bit of money? Do you still treat them the same or no? Like yeah. It, are you pretty neutral? I'm pretty neutral, yeah. Because honestly, like, like, you have to think about it. A lot of the guys that send me small amounts. That's all send, they have. No, but they send, <laughs> it, they send it more often. Oh, the yeah. guys that send small amounts send small amounts, like, really often. You think anybody's sending you, like, 50% of their income? Oh, yeah. Really? I think most men that send money to people on, like, Twitch or OnlyFans or anything like that. I mean, I used to send, like, tons of money. to go to the casino. For sure, dude. I used to send tons of money to a specific Twitch streamer like that, and I couldn't afford Ooh. to do that. Who was What's it? his name? Clint Stevens. I knew it. I Who knew it? it. He's a Super Mario. You don't know who Clint Stevens is? The name sounds really familiar. I. She's a huge. Uh, I'm a longtime Twitch. <laughs> he viewer. also told me he couldn't sub to my OnlyFans <laughs> because he's like, he was like, yeah, I can't do that because if my uh, viewers find out, and I was like, wait, you talked to him? Yeah. You talked to Nick. The. Yeah, I have him on Snapchat. That is insane. You know he's like the, the number one speedrunner. Speed Do you yeah. think that he would like go, come on the buggy boys for us? No, and I think that I probably shouldn't have said this on, but he probably won't see it. So of course not until he comes on here. And no, we tell he's him way bigger it. than us. Yeah, we I sent him a nothing. picture of my ass, and I think all he said was like, "That's a big one." He, goes, <laughs> <laughs> he just said, "He just said, <laughs> he just said, keep eating." Something like that. He's <laughs> like, "Man, it might be better if you." Had Get a little bit bigger. It's funny that you didn't know what Vor was and all this because maybe now you'll go back and like have realizations about all these messages and realize what they're doing to you. And like, yeah, you'll be like, oh, he wasn't sending me $25 for coffee, he was sending me $25 for Oreos and yeah, probably and milkies. Get yourself some dessert this evening. I, I oh, for some nice. reason knew that. I think you used to talk <laughs> about that on Twitch that you used to like Nick Stevens because I knew that for some reason. You just Clint knew. Stevens, Clint, Clint sorry, Clint, <laughs> Clint Stevens. Yeah, I probably did. I was, like, in love with him. And then another girl came on and started donating more than me. And I was like, oh, fuck that. So then we would literally, like, battle. And then we became friends. And I was like, how do you afford this? And she's like, oh, my mom gives me money. And I I told her. She was, like, 17. And she's like, I told my mom I have an online gambling addiction. <laughs> what? And her mom was like, all right. How much money are we talking here? Oh, I probably would spend. I spent, like, my entire tax refund on him one year. How like much was, was your obs- tax refund, though? My tax refunds are negative 15000 so that doesn't mean <laughs> yeah. I ha- yeah, I had to owe this year. It was really sad. Um, back in the day, when I was more poor, I felt like I had bigger tax refunds. Why? Were you saying you had a baby or something like that? No. Three. Three. <laughs> I don't know. I was just like, I'm single, unemployed, and I feel like... So I total, like, two grand in the Clint? Oh, probably, yeah. Jesus Christ. I was obsessed with him, but then it... Well, he's good at out. Super Mario, bro, dude. He's just, like, hot. Do you even speed run? Like, with... No. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just spend Ren. That's Man interesting to find. Times. Like you, you do this. Like this is like kind of your gig. You know, you you go and you get people to pay you, and then like it turns out that you're actually one of these people. Yeah, but that was like, well, also I was on OnlyFans then, so it was OnlyFans money. Yeah, but you're doing the thing that other people are doing. Yeah, that's true. Which is weird. <laughs> I haven't done that in a very long time, but yeah, I, I don't. 
Dude, I think single digits is the most I've ever given anybody on the internet for anything. You're kind of Ouroboros in that situation. I don't know what that means. The endless, the snake that eats itself. The, you know. Oh, cool. Zen and whatnot. Yeah, you know. Um. Yeah, no, definitely no Twitch streamer. If anybody, if I you were never to donated give any, to Amaranth. No, I just sit in her chat long enough, and people gift so many subs that I'll eventually get a free sub. Yeah. Like, if I just leave their chat open, like, 24-7 and just have her dancing or whatever she does on her second monitor, yeah. I'll get a sub. I literally cannot find any of, like, my good long messages right All now. All of her DMs are literally what I've typed in Amaranth chat. Really? Yeah. You love her that much? I used to. Well, it's fine. You don't have to find one if it's going to be super hard. Hold on. Hold on. It'd be like, can you eat me? Oh, I delete. One of the people that I have, like... Would have good DMs. I delete them every like few days because. Does it freak you out? No, I just don't. I don't know. Have you ever felt like your safety was in danger? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. I currently do. Really? Yeah. Like this second. Right is it now. Big Dan? <laughs> you guys. <laughs> yeah. We're um, about to. We're over here. There's. No, I. Someone. I do not say where I live, and someone, said, "Oh, I'm actually moving soon. I'm moving," and they told me the town and. The state and stuff. In the and area. It's like right next to you? Yep. Like right like right I'm next talking to you. like Yeah. Like probably ten minutes from here. From here? Yeah. Damn. Damn. And so then I was like, what the fuck t-? like cause then I'm thinking, there is no way. He's probably really close to the In N Out burger in the Supreme store. <laughs> yeah. That was a good one. Because we, we live in Los Angeles. Yeah, we live in yeah, Los Angeles. Yeah, well obviously. I go to I mean, Erewhon like us. every day. Um, yeah, so I just think there's no way that that's a coincidence. Mm, well, Maybe. we do live next to one of the biggest metropolitan I know, but it's a very specific town. Yeah, Los Angeles. Yeah. Los Angeles. <laughs> yeah, so it's just a little... The burbs of LA. A little weird. Well, th- but that made you feel like you're in danger? Just because I'm like, what? What it- else does he know? Is there not anybody who's been like, I have a fucking gun, I'm going to blow your head off, bitch? No, I've never had anyone threaten me, ever. Yet. Yet. <laughs> Besi- yeah. Unless <laughs> unless it was, like, part of Unless right now, it. where you start pulling a gun out. Start pulling a gun out. <laughs> well, you know, it, you know, it's five o'clock somewhere, so, like, okay. somebody somewhere is probably thinking of threatening somebody. You're like, Maybe someone like a- somewhere is probably thinking about killing you. It isn't me, though. No, it's not. Or maybe not even specifically you. Maybe like a politician or something. Or yeah, or their dog. I or like a very famous politician. No, that's yeah. not true. Well, like a California politician. Oh yeah, maybe. California. Who's not doing it anymore? But I get arrested like next week because of this. And this politician we're talking about—they're frail. They're very thin. They're known for being. They're very about thin. to like get blown away by the wind. They're so thin. This politician. What? Oh, Nancy Pelosi. That's who we're talking about. Yeah, yeah. You're going to kill me. Well, you were at the Capitol riot. You were looking for Nancy Pelosi. I what? Which one of these is Nancy's office? (laughs) Did you say cunt Nancy? Which one of these is this cunt Nancy's office? Here, yo. I got to. Guys. We have to be real. (laughs) Definitely not. (laughs) No, I didn't think so. What? No, no. I want to know now. (laughs) We can't. I shouldn't have even done that. What are your thoughts on Neil deGrasse Tyson and what he did? I don't even know what he did. What? Well, what do you... Do he I sent the whole country into mass <laughs> chaos. I'm so confused. Well, first, let's get your opinion on Neil deGrasse Tyson. Okay. Don't uh, don't have m- much of an opinion. Do you particularly care for him or no? Guys, I don't know what's happening. Well, though, we're not leading you in it. Like You are. No, like, he's not the problem. He's, he's not. He actually might... Some might, say, some might say I genuinely depending on your views not I our views though genuinely might have to like I don't know if I'm thinking of the right person oh uh, the black she, science guy yeah, the yeah. black science okay, guy okay he's kind of relaxing though oh. so you find him relaxing some people would say rack, relax people a whole lot like to like, a point where it's to death what to happened death. guys no he, you're asking Neil, me leading questions Neil deGrasse Tyson on January 6th took a life okay Neil okay <laughs> Neil on his neck Tyson is what they call him. Okay. Neil deGrasse Tyson was actually the person who killed George Floyd on January 6th. 
I hate to break it to you. Wait, on January 6th? On January 6th, at the insurrection, <laughs> that, I didn't Neil know deGrasse... Neil... Died. Neil on his neck Tyson? Neil on his neck Tyson is what they called him after that. And okay. right there on the steps of the Capitol building, he goes, we need to go in there <laughs> and take back our country. Are you sure that wasn't you? And, oh. And then, you know, George is doing his thing. Uh, and then everybody's like, yeah! Yeah! And then... We all saw the video. We know how it ended. But. So we just wanted to know like, how you felt about Neil deGrasse Tyson considering he did kill George Floyd. Well, <laughs> On January I don't like 6th. this. What? I'm not having fun anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Is it just with you? That's why we whispered it first. Yeah, that's why I said no. <laughs> but, I mean, it... You know what? Stuff like that isn't cool. I do. I am like a big conspiracy theorist. And so you you know so, so about you it know then. He did it. Like I I'm really into like the government conspiracies. <laughs> oh god. Do you think there's lizard people in the wall? Not lizard people. In the wall. In like, the wall. These maybe. walls. There's people in the wall. Yeah. You think so? Have you seen those videos where like men like hide in people like just live in people's walls? Yes. I have. Have I you seen that video that. where the girls like put it up their attic and there's just a guy sleeping? Yes. Oh, ah, ah, yeah, ah, ah. I can't. I can't. I can't. That I can't. could be your life. <laughs> Stop! Oh my god! Oh my god! That Wait, they actually. Put them up there. What? They, no, there's a, she, she. There's like a lady who drops ceiling tiles like yeah, this. Yes. <laughs> You've seen it, right? Yeah, I hate that. No, it gives me like. Ugh. Very recently, like. Maybe within the last three years, my dad wanted me to go up into the attic for something. Okay. And I totally pussied out. I was like, uh, I have no idea what's in that attic. I'm not opening that. He goes, just open it! <laughs> and I go, no, I'm scared. He goes, what the fuck do you mean you're scared? You're My man. pussy you're, son. You're, you're 22 years old. You gotta... And I go, no, I'm not... O- what if there's a scary what if there's in there? A, what if there's a spider up there? That's what, I think I literally said that. I go, what if there's like a tarantula up there? I'm not afraid something? of that. Spiders. I don't have many fears besides like people in your drop ceiling. <laughs> yeah, people in my house watching me. I don't like critters. I don't mind critters. That's because you attribute also, a large level George. of consciousness to them. I also told my entire family last week that I'm not afraid to get kidnapped, and they didn't believe me. <laughs> I mean, here you are. So obviously, you're not very. I'm not because kidnapped. I am one step away from a mental break where I just go nuts. So I want someone to try and grab me. Like the like the flappy. Flappy Bird guy. You remember he went crazy <laughs> in yes. the middle of L.A.? Yes. Neil, deGr- Neil deGrasse Tyson hates critters. <laughs> he hates them. He's an exterminator, you might say. <laughs> Shut My up. My ribs hurt. Oh, God. He hates critters. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Well, watch your aura on the critter. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> oh, God. I kind of feel like I'm in a little casting couch area. No, we, there's we moved the you couch see the because I told him that I was like, yeah, you're like, get the black couch out of here. She's already used to that. I it's was like, too dude, much. come on. Obviously, the camera is the couch. She's gonna get the wrong idea right yeah. away. Yeah, so that's why the the full, or the computer chair because there was what there yeah, was. Yeah, it's was not a, the one I have. That's pink and cute. Yeah, <laughs> do you think that helps you with the getting the money, or is that for you more? It's not to get good at games. I was in an e-girl. That's true. I was in an e-girl phase, so it was kind of for me, and then I realized you just get attention for it, so then. Does it give you lumbar support? No, not really. But there's a pillow. She she probably didn't. She just didn't use it. You got to clip the pillow in. I do like it because it has a little, like, little footrest part. Oh, really? I got it from Walmart. It's pretty sick, From Walmart? (laughs) Yeah. How much was it? Like not expensive at all. Oh, okay. Less than a hundred. What? Yeah. Okay. It's shit. It I built it I actually built it on Twitch and I was building it and just men were coming into my chat like, What the fuck are you doing, you idiot? <laughs> oh, I was there for that. I think that you probably me. were. Yeah, you probably were. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're screwing it in wrong. You thought it was like multiple was, different but people, I am but it was like, just me in different times. I am genuinely stupid. So I was like putting in pieces like upside down and <laughs> Not. The wheels are at the top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Going in on, in separate yeah. tabs is funny. And now every time you like sit on it, it's like. Well, like it's 50 that. bucks at yeah. Walmart. So That's true. Walmart chair. I can't believe that. That's yeah. absurd. Yeah. We only have again. Hermes Mille. You could get a, a chair. You could get a chair online. But they're so expensive. Dude. Yeah. And I've I also heard. I've also heard like the generic like gaming chairs are like the most uncomfortable things ever. The DX racer. I yeah. hate DX racer. I've heard they're so they, uncomfortable. They, they suck. Yeah, I've heard their Office shit. Chairs. Office chairs. Not even That's like that, but uh, ones mesh. with like no bag. Like mesh I bag, yeah. have, guys. I got a mesh I bag. have a superpower. What? Finding office chairs on the side of the road. 
like someone's like, oh, it's trash. And I literally found one the other day that's like brand new and like super, the box was next to it. So I looked it up and it's like an expensive chair. A lot of chairs are expensive. I didn't know how much chairs were yeah. until I started looking into buying a chair. Let me tell you, wait until you see, like move into your own house and see how, because Sorry, I live in my own place. Um, yeah, in a way better neighborhood. Yeah, way better neighborhood. Way better neighborhood. Um, Where the president's dog is there. She said, Shut you live in beep there. <laughs> yeah, right. No, but wait till you see how expensive, like, curtains are and stuff like that. It's ridiculous. Well, it's going to be expensive in a place, especially if you're trying to keep people out from your ceiling. Exactly. You should get a gun and just start shooting. You should shooting. get a gun, probably. So, guys, I genuinely cannot do that because I am... Oh, yeah. Oh, you're legally bound to not get a gun? No. Oh. I am so klutzy and, like, actually stu- I would harm someone or myself. You put it in a safe. No, like, I Well, would. you keep the bullets separate. Even just learning how to shit, like, it would be bad. Like, I can't do that. I would hurt myself. I can't even go, like, anywhere without, like, tripping or dropping something. I break everything I touch. Like, it's just not a good idea to give me, like, a weapon. I do have a knife, and the first day, I got a knife for Christmas. The first day I had it, I held it wrong and cut my finger open. Oh, that makes me cringe. And then I was embarrassed by it, so I went in, it was on Christmas, like, at my grandma's house, and I was really embarrassed, and my uncle was like, oh, are you, like, what just happened? And I'm like, <laughs> so I went in the bathroom, and I, like, put band-aids on and just pretend like it didn't happen. Do you guys wow. like that story? Uh, yeah, I've just, like, got tired, but that was yeah. good. <laughs> I, think I was tired been of being, like, the first five minutes, but. No, I just got sleepy. <laughs> I think it would have been better if you started, like, eating or something in the middle of the story. We were going to yeah. get, like, Fifty dollars worth of Taco Bell, but we didn't have time. Well, it's good because I wouldn't have eaten it. Yeah, that's crazy. You gotta I don't. I'm. Mickey D's. I am the pickiest eater you guys have probably ever met. I guarantee. I you. like chicken nuggets. And I know that's cringe, but I genuinely like. I have panic attacks trying to eat foods. What? Yeah. And if they touch, dude, it's over. Dude, well, could you imagine if you put your ketchup on your French fries? No. Ooh, I like that though. I could. I can drink ketchup, and I do. What's your picky eater food? What do you mean? Like, like what do you not eat? That was is normal. Name something. What's something that's pork normal chops. that you don't eat? I like pork chops. Okay, so so far we're two for two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like I've never eaten an avocado. I've never eaten. What about like guacamole? Once it's all like mixed up. Apparently, <laughs> I've I never eaten an o- avocado. What about guacamole? Well, I'm, I'm just saying, like this guy, this guy, dude, this is so insane. <laughs> what about guacamole? Um, God damn it. Dude. No, apparently I did what try a it drunk idiot. once. Idiot. You ahead, tried what? I tried guacamole drunk once, but I don't remember it. Okay, so then we're getting hey, somewhere. If you're drunk, it didn't happen. Someone tried to <laughs> give me chili dip, and I had a panic attack. I don't. Really what did. does that mean, though, by panic it's attack? Like I literally, like heart palpitations, had to go into the other room and be like, "You're okay, you're okay." She had to go put out a lit cigarette on herself. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're here. You're actually awake right now. <laughs> you're okay. Psh, wake up. Yeah, I hate food, but I also love it. You know. Oh yeah. I'm just. W- I oh, see that you're trying not to say something, so just oh, say it. Oh, we know. <laughs> we know your fat ass loves it. Listen, you don't got to tell us <laughs> twice, or we once, see- or once. We don't got to tell us once. You oh, know, no. I know th- it looks like we're blind, but we're not. I don't like. Hold on. What about like pizza rolls? Only cheese. Mm, what I about love pizza roll? I'm I'm bad at this. I can't think of something. What about sushi? No, I'm. N- I haven't. I've never had fish. Maybe. Fish? I, yeah. It, like any kind of sushi stuff. Mm, yeah. <sighs> I have to pee again. And in the way. Yeah. yeah. Well, we should probably go buy weed anyways, no? Yeah, that's getting really boring. I'm kind of bored. You guys are kind of annoying. I'm going to go buy weed. Bored. We're going to go buy weed, so. All right. Yeah, we're bored. You guys are, like, kind of annoying. We're 